Hello everyone, this is Tormuse, and today, picking up where I left off in my Grounded game, uh, hoping to make some real progress this time. I mean, yesterday's stream, I feel like I didn't make a lot of progress. Uh, I made some progress, but ultimately was kind of frustrated. I mean, I'm fi <laughs> finding a, a, a getting a lot of that experience uh, in, in this in this game uh, of <laughs> just feeling frustrated generally. Why is this thing frozen here? Is the stream on? It says it's streaming. The timer isn't going. Okay, now the timer's going. That was weird. Anyway. Um, yeah, consulted a walkthrough. Um, a, a better walkthrough, I should say. The, the <laughs> I consulted a walkthrough during the stream yesterday and uh, was annoyed to find out afterwards that the walkthrough was wrong, uh, which didn't help. Um, and, uh, yeah, but I just consulted a better walkthrough, and now I know where to go. <laughs> so, and I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, uh, raise a fuss about it, uh, when it's, uh, when, okay, as soon as this thing loads and it gets into the game, I'm gonna raise a fuss about it, I'll show you what I mean. Um, but, uh, yeah, uh, hopefully I will actually finish, uh, exploring the, the pond lab and stuff this time. All uh, right, uh, my spider dagger is like halfway down here. Um, how much? What, it takes okay. It takes spider venom to repair. I've got three of them. I wonder if I should take some time to uh, hmm, uh, go whack a wolf spider to get more venom. Uh, okay, so the respawn point is set over here. That's fine. Let's just toss this rotten meat somewhere. There we go. Uh, let's cook up the aphid. Uh, we could do with some more. Uh, I could do with some more. A bunch of supplies here. Let's get some more uh, sprigs and plant fiber. Because I might as well. Oops, not the pebble. Uh, I wouldn't mind repairing up the shield, too, for that matter. I need to keep an eye out for weevils on my way over there. Oh, speak the devil. It's like, where'd he go? Okay, just wait for the poison to take effect and just wait for him to explode. Alright, so just, um... Yeah, most of my stuff is... Decent enough in terms of repairs and stuff. Okay. Oh right. Um, yeah, the slime lantern's full. That should be fine. No water filtration tablets needed. Ah. Uh, okay. Well, that one got away from me. Uh, let's see, uh, I'm gonna collect some more clover just because. I don't, I, like, I don't want to ever, like, run out of clover, because it's, it's needed for the, uh, Merkers. I just want to make sure I have a good supply of, like, basic resources on my person at all times. Yeah, same with the sprigs. <clears throat> I'm just gonna keep an eye out for like aphids and weevil opportunity. Why am I injured? Oh right, because I didn't heal when I slept overnight. It seems. <laughs> just waiting for the poison to take effect. Uh, when am I? Oh, I don't have any bandages left. Okay, yeah, well I need to keep up. Keep an eye out for sap so I can make some make a bandage. Uh, I'd rather save the the insects. For uh, 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 what, you know, emergency healing. Here we go. There's some sap. Make a bandage out of that. Here we go. 
use the the slow healing for non-emergencies like this. I hear you, Weevil. Does this Spider Fang Dagger do less damage than the larva, uh, larva blade that I've been using? It's possible, considering uh, I did upgrade the uh, larva blade more. Makes the Spider Fang Dagger a little dumb then. <laughs> oh well. Should I see if I can pick up a wolf spider kill on the way? I march location 64 centimeters from here. That's where I uh, was able to take out a wolf spider without too much trouble before. How many arrows do I have? Mm, 61? Hmm. Feel better if I had more arrows. Should have made more arrows before I left home. Oh well. Oh yeah, that reminds me. I I do believe I have enough uh, uh, crow feathers part parts for the for the crow crossbow. Cro the crow's bow. Hmm. Uh, where did I where did I put that spider marker? I was just looking at it and now I've lost sight of it. It could be that I'm standing too close to it and it just faded out. Regardless, I should probably... If I'm, if I'm thinking of taking on the giant spider, uh, I should probably reset my respawn point first. Let's pair this up. and cook these guys up. <clears throat> oh yeah, that reminds me. Um, yeah, just craft them all up. Um, Um, sorry, what was I about to say? Um, I started to say that reminds me, and then I, I got distracted and then forgot what I was going to, what, what, it, what, 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 what reminded me of what. Um, Wow, I must be uh, must be tired at the moment or something. Don't really remember what it's like to not be tired though. <laughs> Let's just get a few of these just to get my get my stamina meter off the bottom there. Anyway, I was just top of the water and um, make a, a very ill-advised attack against the uh, the wolf spider. It's perfectly contently sleeping in the uh, in this little cave there, and <laughs> it'd probably be better if I just left him alone. Okay, so where is that spider? Okay, there's a spider marker. 56 centimeters away. Okay, can I jump over the, this this way? There you go. You can jump pretty high.
There's the spider marker. Now, if I fire from over here, we'll... Seriously? Because I don't have a good angle here. Let's go. Is he gonna, is he gonna climb up here? Ah, frick, okay, that startled me. Okay, I'm uncertain whether or not he can actually get up here. Shh. Hold still. down there and deal with it in melee. As long as it keeps moving in that kind of pattern, maybe I'm fine. Probably should have brought the wolf spider mount over here so I can do extra damage. Let's let the stamina recharge a bit. Ah, frick, hit the wrong button. Thirty-nine arrows. I'd feel better if I was going into this with more arrows. That's this is fine. I'll I'll finish him off in melee. <laughs> See all the arrows lodged in his uh, abdomen there. Being an arachnid, he has two body segments the abdomen and the cephalothorax. Cephalothorax meaning, uh, I mean, cephalo meaning having to do with the head, and thorax meaning having to do with the chest. Basically, uh, in uh, the spider world, the, the head and chest are like one thing. Not like in uh, insects where it's divided into three segments head, thorax, and abdomen. And really lots of animals and living things. Okay, so I'm, when I go into melee, I'm, yeah, he's going to have like 80% of his hit points gone. This is fine. I can finish him off and without too, too much trouble, hopefully. Alright, time for you to die by the very weapon you adore. Spider Fang. Ow, son of a jerk. Okay, that didn't go well. Ah, oh, and he knocked me down. Get up, get up, get up. Ah, Frig! You did this weird quad move I wasn't expecting there. Oh, that, that was unfortunate. Uh, let's go recover with all the arrows now. Okay, you know what? I just to grab some water. Forget it. Uh, screw this. Just go straight there before he has a chance to heal. Uh, um, which direction was it again? It was over here, right? Oh, I can just where my backpack is, that'll tell me. I hope all my things are still here. Forty-six arrows. He's okay, he's healing as I'm doing this, so yeah, he did that weird quad move twice. Oh, he's back up to full, damn it. Get 
the shield out, get the thing out. This isn't good. Is most of it? Most of the enemies in this, like they, they do attack in sequences of one or three attacks. So as, after he did the three attack thing, I wasn't expecting a fourth attack to come, that's what threw me last time. sense in me I would have had the bandages ready before starting this fight. <laughs> that would require that I have some measure of intelligence. Oh well. And the spider fang is badly damaged. Uh, that's just great. And the best part about it is, uh, yeah, if, if I'd uh, been able to finish him off, then... Uh, be able to get the venom that I needed to, to repair, which was the whole heckin' reason I was fighting him in the first place. Hooray! Um. <sighs> okay. Um. At least get the bandages ready, I guess. Is, is he back up to full? He's back up to full. I was wondering if maybe I could get him before he healed back up, but no such luck, I guess. We have 48 arrows. This is not a good state to be tr attempting this in. If I'm going to try this, I, I really should have more healing sources. Um, um, fresh my memory, wolf spiders, what... Uh, Yeah, they're weak to slashing weapons, so I... Uh, the wolf fang... the spider fang dagger is the one to use. Oh yeah, didn't I get a new mutation? Buff lungs. You can heal and your cells burn bright with enhanced energy capacity. Plus max damage, okay. Was it that one or was there something else? Fresh defense? Oh wait, I already got that. I already looked at that. Cardio fan, Mertine, the push and pull of thick, rich pond water, coaxes your gummy little body into becoming a part of this world. Your your permeable skin begins to utilize an electrochemical gradient that propels your limbs like mighty flagella and aids in respiration. Plus minor swim speed, plus junior diver. Okay. Okay. One hit? Huh, one hit wonder. <clears throat> Do 
I don't even really need to take on the wolf spider. I mean, I should probably just focus on going back to, you know, doing what I said I was going to do and uh, finish off the pond lab. Let's grab some tadpole meat. That'll do. Where are the tadpoles? Usually they swim around in little schools. Where are, where is everybody? I'm hearing the koi. Where's the koi? Losing sight of it is probably not a good thing. <laughs> One time he rushed at me in the last episode, kind of freaked me out. I guess I'll grab some lily pad wax, why not? everybody N no diving bell spiders no tadpoles no water boatmen like it's so weird there's just there's just nothing I don't know should I make one more attempt at the the wolf spider I think if, I, if I'm going to try it again, I should come back with the actual wolf spider mount, which I, I did ha I did make one, and it's over by the other wolf spider cave. So yeah, maybe I should just hold off on that for now. Um, I'll just... Uh, uh, I'll put the bone dagger in its place for now. Oops. Uh, I do need to get re recover my corpse though. Where is that? 140 centimeters away. Ah, darn it. It's uh, 140. Centimeters. It's a little less than five feet away. Feels like quite a trek, though. Um, that's slot seven, I guess. Hmm, there's an arrow. Seven centimeters away. Sorry, what was that noise? Oh, was that a firefly? Cover the backpack. more arrows around here. Can't see anything. Choke it down, Pete. Nom nom nom. Pardon me, little ant. 
acorn bit just sitting there? There's an arrow. I'm really up to now. 57? Hmm. Um, okay. Before I go back into the water, where is... There it is, 68 centimeters away. Almost nice. Um, <laughs> just want to grab some water before I go into the water. I mean, grab some potable water. Need something I can drink before I can go into the water that I can't drink. <laughs> before, before, before going into the drink. There you go. Not feeling great about how badly damaged the shield is. If I could. If I another weevil, I'd feel a lot better about going in there. Keeping an ear out for weevils. Maybe I can just wing it. I mean, I, I don't know if there are going to be a lot of dangerous things down there. Juice drop? Sure, take it. I don't hear any weevils, I haven't seen any. I haven't seen or heard much of anything really. I heard a crow a second ago. Anyway, uh, okay, so the T-Rex is there. I'm going to jump into the water shortly. That's the koi. That koi sounds alarmingly close. Alright, we're going to put the slime... Where is the slime lantern? Slime lantern in slot 5. We're going to put the... Feel a little less squishy now. The bubble helmet on. We're gonna put the flippers on wherever they are. There they are. The fin flops. This is uncomfortably low. We have to worry about it later, I guess. All right. Here I go. Let's just dive quickly. Maybe I can avoid the koi that way. Okay, there's the T-Rex, that's my landmark. Uh, let's just top up my oxygen for no particular reason. You know, it might be a little dangerous to linger here, hearing that, that koi about. Boop, boop. <laughs> Yo, Rex. <laughs> Anyway, um, we're just going to speed on through here, and I'm going to show you uh, the thing that frustrated me in my, uh, in my previous game, my previous uh, session, I should say. Um, so, when I was playing this game yesterday, uh, I came in into this this little this little tunnel here. It's like, aha! I found my way into the pond lab. Great. And then you know I looked all around, and then I uh, saw, oh hey, there's a big switch here, and I flipped the switch, and kaboom! You know, power grid problem. Oh no! And this thing lit up, and these things lit up, and and it's, it's made this big to do of, uh, oh, you need to go uh, reset the uh, the breakers. Fine. Um, and so I went and did that, and then naturally I came back into this room again, because this is where that quest to reset the breakers came from. So it seemed logical to return here. 
And then I notice, oh, hey, look, there's an exclamation mark there. That wasn't there before. I guess that's my quest marker. That's telling me where I'm supposed to go. And I look, and it's like, oh, it's on the other side of the door. I mean, it's clearly on the other side of the door. It says 16 centimeters away. Like, it's, it's like, right there. It's like, okay, now it's, like, 13 centimeters. It's, like, right, right on the other side of the door. That is clearly where I'm supposed to go. And it's locked. Oh, okay. Um, don't know what I'm supposed to do with that. And I look at my objectives, and my objectives say... Uh, enter the opening of the depths. Okay. What opening? That, that locked door? And then I, I look, or I, I, you know, can carry on, I go down here, and look, and oh look, the exclamation mark's on the other side of this door, too. I, I guess this door leads to the same place I'm supposed to go, and it's also locked. So, obviously, obviously from my perspective, logically, that means that my destination uh, that I'm supposed to go is not through these doors. There must be some other door um, I'm supposed to go first that unlocks these doors so I can get to my actual destination of the uh, of the exclamation mark there. Um, you know that, and where where that is, who the heck knows? This game's not going to tell me. But then, uh, and this and this is. The, frust the, the frustration of this is, is compounded by the fact that I, I consulted a walkthrough. I figured, okay, maybe there's something I'm missing. Maybe there was some switch or terminal or something that opens that door that I wasn't aware of. Uh, and the instructors just say, go through the door. It just, that just says, it just says, go through the door. Okay. But I can't go through the door. So what am, what am I supposed to do here? And it says... Uh, Oh, pick up the, uh, the 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 badge from the uh, from the guy, the, the the miniature skeleton, the dead guy, uh, in the other room. Okay, I got that. I I didn't think it did anything, and you made me go all the way back home to pick it up again and back here again, only to find that no, it didn't actually do anything. Um, the walkthrough was just wrong. So you know, this is frustrations mounting on frustrations, and. Uh, so I, I looked up a YouTube video walkthrough so I could watch someone do it so that I can, uh, you know, figure out where what it is I'm supposed to do. Like, is it like I'm going because I'm going like, oh, is this something? Am I just being really thick uh, or, or something? Or is this something or, or what? Uh, and you know what? That's it there. That's the room I'm supposed to go in. Next to the other insignia, you know, you know, like I passed by that, I saw it before. I didn't know it was a door. Like this is like I saw these insignias here. There's no indication that this was a door. But this is where I'm supposed to go, apparently. That's that's the opening that this thing alluded to. And you know, there are probably plenty of players who play this game who didn't have the issue that I had because they were inattentive, they didn't notice the exclamation mark and just wandered elsewhere and then and then came in and it's like, oh, if you're looking at it from outside, then it's obvious where to go. Uh, in fact, I, it would not surprise me in the slightest if the dev team added that exclamation point because a previous set of playtesters had no effing clue where they were supposed to go. So, yeah, so I guess this door and this door correspond to those doors. Oh, they're closed. Huh. Um, is this a, uh, is this a little button to open it? There it is. Now it's open. Okay. Why? Why is this door here then? Or why is it locked until you go in through the other door? That is bad design. Like if if the dev team really really wanted to have a door here, um make it open at the same time as that door opens. 
so you don't have this frustration, this needless, needless frustration. There is no reason why they couldn't have this door unlock at the same time as that one. It would have saved me a heck of a lot of time. I, I spent two frickin' hours yesterday wandering around trying to figure out what the frick I was supposed to do. Because the dev team decided, oh, this door should be locked for some reason. I, 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 cannot, I cannot fathom. It's just bad. And this door closes afterward anyway. So, like, why? And apparently... Okay, it seems, okay, I was going to say, uh, am I unable to go through it? I guess it reopens again. Like, what? There, there's no reason. There is no reason for that. Like, it actually makes no sense. Why would you design it that way? You're just, you're just going to make people frustrated for no reason. Where does this door lead? still locked so yeah basically th like this it, like don't get me wrong this is a fun game it's an interesting game it's a compelling game but it's got some really dumb irritating design choices that are like why would you do that because because make no mistake I mean ev everything You know, I'm, I'm, I grew up in a family of engineers, you know, so I know that a machine is only as good as the people who built it. Um, you know, and for that, as far as that analogy goes, this this game is, is, is a machine. It's, it's people designed it. And everything you do when you're designing that machine uh, is a choice. Uh... Including the the non choices you make. I mean, if you chose not to do something, that's a choice in itself. You know. Okay, there's some raw science. Am I gonna? Okay. Might I might meet more of those bots. Got the science. Got the science. Uh, okay. Before I venture into that water, there, let's take a look around here. The cameras are still operating, it looks like. Why is this blurry? Is that a graphical glitch? Okay, I guess it was. So there's chemical formula. I, am I about to run into those Brussels sprouts that he uh, plumped up? That looks like some kind of... It's a depiction of the nervous system. It's a blueberry. I guess that's supposed to be a Brussels sprout, because his, his message was talking about uh, 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 grafting human parts onto Brussels sprouts. Get stronger if I eat these muscle sprouts. Yeah. Wait, really? You 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 really, you just you're just gonna eat it there, Pete? Okay. Let's see what this says. Ham's test day 36, generation 7 fitness stable. So this is a whole month since he started this thing. Vascular systems have evolved into something inspirational. Sprout musculature amplifications research is going swimmingly. Haha. <laughs> generation 4 being taught the rhythm of the flesh in a way the fungal networks could transmit was certainly key. Wait, what? The rhythm of the flesh, the way the fungal networks could transmit was certainly key. Fungal networks? Is he making uh, neural nets out of fungus? I know he's doing experiments with fungus as well. Uh, anyway, each node is performing in tandem at peak efficiency. Condensed crop cycle manipulation is accelerating generational hybrid evolution at an unprecedented rate. Hands is proving to be highly advantageous apparatus. Super dense Brussels sprouts, muscle sprouts. Conducting a ripe symphony of proteins, lipids, and carbohydrates via the push and pull of plant and muscle fibers, the applications here for sustainable, humane, omnivorous diets are tantalizing. Notes. Consider an aerobics program for the lab monitor array to increase nitrification and introduce a motivational aspect to growth. Plug data into Burgle's recipe module. Finally, something we can share a common bond over. It's 
like, oh hey, I'm actually producing food, something that uh, something that uh, Virgo will appreciate. Uh, am I actually supposed to eat it? I mean, I don't know. The game is directing me to eat it, so I guess that's I guess it's safe to. What do we got in here? Ooh, marble shards. That's cool. How do I get in there? Is there another entrance I'm missing? Do I have to go for a swim and approach from below or something? There's no obvious way to open that. Splash, splash, splash everywhere I go. <laughs> oh, another one of these? I spy. Yep. Power grid control. Okay. So there's a. Yeah, am I going to have to find another password? Yeah, Alright. Oh, I just realized my. Uh, Water's at the bottom here. I should probably nice clean. drink up. Oh yeah, I didn't use the um, the mega molar. What's it? Okay. You stick a step back and it distorts. Wild. Anyway, well, let's see what's down here. I guess. Oh, okay. That's also locked. Still the locked doors in this place. Still the locked doors in this game. I mean, I guess they help the pacing of the story. Fine, fair enough. It's just <sighs> all right. This is the last place to look, so better be a way through. Those are uh, quartzite shards? Nice. Hey, it stacks up to 16? Really? I thought it maxed out at 15. Anyway, that'll be a nice boost for my weaponry. Shield out. Ah, frick, stun me right for your first hit. Okay, I can't. I do have the weapon out, right? Oh. The hell? Why can't I hit you? Back the way it came? Got turned around all the same. Or maybe. Wait. Was that back the way it came? Oh no, I'm, I'm in a different room. Should have made another slime lantern. What over here? Muscle Sprouts Test Kitchen. There's also Dr. Wendell Tully prepared by Burgle. Ingredient assessment. He, he tested it on himself. Oh dear. I mean. Hmm. Indications were that he is testing the uh, 
the Brussels spread. I mean, not the, the 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 fungal stuff on himself too. And he was. It sounded like he was going a little mad. Um, is like. Wendell Tully going to turn out to be like the final boss of this or something, and he's going to be turn out like be super strong and super nuts and just <laughs> generally like altered in some way. Ingredient assessment: test samples are currently 0.833 percent of target production size. <laughs> Complex and somewhat tense muscular nuggets. Several flaps overlap to protect a central organ. All entirely edible. An innate sense of fitness and survival compels them to fight against preparation. What? <laughs> they they don't want to be eaten? A smack of the spatula calms them right down? Yeesh. Initial recipe module analysis indicates use as a replacement for dry aged beef liver. Unexpected. Compiling flavor profile compatibility. Results? Onions. <laughs> <laughs> Prepare them with onions, okay? Marble shards. All right, is this thing gonna work, or am I gonna have to hunt down another password? Ooh. Doctor Applebaum has pronounced me in perfect health. Hmm. For a man twenty years my senior. Ha. I must face the facts. The gray hairs, the wrinkles, they are not figments of the imagination. I can draw only one reasonable conclusion. It is the elusive fractional errors of the shrinking process which are the cause. Trudy has asked that I discontinue my experiments, but what choice do I have? If I quit now, I will have nothing. What will I be other than a failed inventor and scientist with no discoveries to his name, unable even to teach the basics of physics to a gaggle of hormonal teenagers? No! If this means that I must sacrifice 20 years of my life, then so be it. Hmm. Yeah, there's the sunken cost fallacy. His feeling of, ah, uh, if I give up now, then I'll have nothing. Well, I mean, you still want your wife and kids. Does count for something, sure, let's really mash keys, sure. Wait, really? Reboot biodome turn off. Pond hatch biodome access ramp. Biodome auto mode. It's a, it's a bio, bio mode, sorry, biodome auto mode seems to be no. Reboot biodome terminal. Okay, where's the biodome? Pond hatch biodome axer. Does this does this open up all those other hatches that I, I found so far? Yeah, sorry, this a quest mar uh thingy flew up there, I didn't see what it said. Find oh find the plus super chip, okay. I mean that's the the main goal anyway. Okay. All right. Um, chips are here and here. Pond hatch. Death's mouth. This one's in the second pot. And there's a hatch under here too. There were there were a bunch of hatches like. Does this mean they're all open now? Did these other doors open? Okay. All right, that's convenient. So I don't necessarily have to go for a swim, although I am going to go for a swim anyway, because uh, it looked like there was unexplored stuff down there. Where is... I can never... It, it's moving, it's moving, you know, it's not my imagination. Like the reason I'm having trouble finding things in my inventory is it keeps moving them around. The slime lantern was in this slot before. <sighs> Whatever. Like I'm not imagining it. It's it's moving stuff around, and that's that's why I have to hunt for it every time. It's not because they're not where I left them. Uh, I 
see. Okay, that's that's how I got turned around. Aha. So I'm glad they came back down here then, because there was more stuff to be found. Ooh, oh, this looks interesting. What could this be? Where's the heckin' shovel? There we go. I can dig these things out of the way. Bet I could fit through here. Doesn't hurt to grab some uh, some clay while I'm at it. There's a scabby scheme there. Ginger spice. Is that a reference to Jerry Hallowell or just ginger in general? <sighs> it's which Jerry Hallowell being a name that I know for reasons. <laughs> uh, she's she's uh, she's one of the Spice Girls. Uh, who goes by the name Ginger Spice. <laughs> um, yeah, and I got some free clay out of it. I don't know. That, that, was, that was in uh, an era that... Um, I, I was, uh, you know, I was really into pop music, I guess. So is this door going to be open now? I have a feeling, yeah, this leads in, yep, it leads back in here. Okay. I see how they all connect now. You can uh, grab a stack of these things, just, you know, need some more food shortly. So what the heck, let's just pull these out. I don't have to go hunt for food when I get out there. Um, okay. So... What am I hearing? The heck did you come from? Ah, oh, frick. I thought it... <clears throat> Ah, it moved my stuff around. God damn it! Need to find the heckin' hammer. I was trying to switch to the hammer. Where's the hammer? Where is it? Holy heckin' moly! Oh, is that a critical hit? Okay. Um, right. Anyway, I need to. Okay, I'm distract my brains trying to remember where all the the doors were. Okay. Yeah, there are lots of doors around here, aren't there? Filtration tablets needed. Let's take out whoever's left quickly before I uh, before I run into food. Um, I've got one more food item left.
Footprints? These aren't my footprints. I haven't been this way. That's ominous. Bandages? Oh yeah, granola bars. I did uh, find some granola bars. Let's get those ready just in case. Okay, there are multiple of them. If I can get one of them to approach at a time. Ah, another one of these archers again. That's right, come this way. A little bit closer. Just a... Don't make me shoot you. Hey, you. damage. I wanted, I wanted to fix it before I came in here because I anticipated that there were probably going to be more of these guys in here. But there weren't any weevils, so what can you do? This game doesn't let you stockpile that kind of resource. That's just the way the game operates. Do those things bounce? Oh, great. I was afraid of that. Getting attention to multiples of the time. one more, but any more besides that guy, I mean. Hey, I raised my shield. gambling that I could swing the hammer enough times before uh, before I could finish charging that up there. Yeah, use a bandage. Oh, I've got seven of them? Huh. Because yeah, I did pick up some more. Um, are you going to use it or what? There you go. Resource analyzer? I don't think I picked up anything recently. Uh, Oh, here you are. Either had to be one of these around here somewhere. Okay. I feel better about my water situation. I don't suppose I can smash this, can I? I'm just curious. I wonder if I picked up that uh, water flea meat prematurely. Eh, it's, it's fine. They're fine. I can cook them up later. It's all good. Oh, nice. So these stack up past... Uh, past 15. Do they count as projectiles, like arrows? Make them, they can... Uh, Or something? I don't know. Anyway, Ham's Test Day 7. Oh, this is an early one. 
Nominal results, not even marginally different from initial pretest runs. Nitrogen cycle levels remain optimal and the local fungal network appears robust. Uh, Brussels sprouts seem slightly loose and fairly limp. They need something to promote growth, but I can't put my finger on it. Other phalangeal observations, phalangeal observations. Trudy finds her ring better suited for the koi pond substrate than her hand. So that's her ring in there, I guess. Um, is that sorry? Is that suggesting that she deliberately threw her ring in there? Because that, I mean, it, it sort of strikes me as an act of contempt. Like was she mad at him and threw her wedding ring in there? That's, I mean, like, like wedding ring. That's that's a you know, it's, it's a, that's a pretty strong statement of anger. If that's what that's what happened, if that's what that was about, or is, or did he just uh, observe that he found it in there and she just lost it accidentally? I mean, I don't know. Anyway, no, it's work on making calls to the. Ha Work on making calls to the house. Tell Burgle to fish that ring out of the pond. W. Back. The, the, the fishwife's ring. It sank to the ground and it, s it sparkled by light. Was lost and then snarfed as sunk, sunk Koi's bite. Her big wiggly mouth, a glistening thing. It swallowed up whole the glittering ring. Twin barbells flicker. Her fins they did flop. Sorry, did flap. It appeared she was choking. Her dorsal I did, I did slap. Curled to the beyond, the ring was now free, as well as one eye, which then winked at me. Are you my wife now? asked both my heart big and true. Up Krugel's response, aye, it's your fishwife. Me name's Trudy, too. Um, okay. So he's turned to rhyming? He's writing poetry? So the koi tried to eat it, and he slapped it until it spit it out, and then it, as well as one eye, which then winked at me. Did, did the koi lose an eye? Does the koi have only one eye? I can't say I observed that. Trudy, too? Yeah, it really is losing it, eh? That's the image of the ring, I suppose. This is the layout of that, that western part of the pond. View, viewed from, from the north, I guess. Judging by the positioning of where the ring is and where the that dome is. Efficiency? Huh. Let me get this thing out. Power of Helion. Champion of the sun. Stick to the torch, which works out of water, if I can help it. Save this. Underwater torch for underwater. Okay, so there's a ramp going up there. There's also this door, which... Oh, hell. Um, okay, let's, let's go up the ramp first. Oh, are these the, these are the muscle sprouts? The range of big circle that's ominous. I have the option to consume one. I, I mean, I I guess I'll give it a whirl. Jump it down, Pete. You discovered muscle sprout. Okay, did it give me any new abilities or something? It didn't... Okay, well they stack, so... Is this something that can be... Oh, they only stack up to five. 
An edible hybrid Brussels sprout, chewy muscle flaps, ripe and flexed, restores hunger when eaten, but also causes pain. Sprouts giveth and sprouts taketh away, mostly useful for enhancing smoothies. Oh, okay. Shoot. There are only I can only hold five per inventory slot. If I if I'd enhanced uh, so there are thirty of them in total. I just ate one. They only ate one. Another audio cassette. Oh no, it's the super chip. Wait, really? Oh, okay. Huh. Turn the pawn super chip to burgle. All right. Oh, that's not except fight with Trudy. Oh dear. This time you've gone too far, Wendell Tully. You've done the unthinkable, trespassed the unforgivable. You missed Thanksgiving dinner. Hmm. Who can blame Trudy? I know hey. that I pushed things to the breaking point, and that she has grit her teeth and borne it. She told me that she could not bear to watch me destroy my life, let alone hers, the children's, in single-minded pursuit of this technology. Never in all the years of knowing her has she given me such a cold, immovable ultimatum. Hmm. My science or my family. But if only she could see. I am doing this for them. I understand hmm. it has been hard. It has been harder on no one more than myself. If only I had more time. If I could just prove to them the wonders that are so, so close now, they would understand, wouldn't they? And if they did not, perhaps they never understood me mm. at all. Uh, uh, hey, Slayer Rabbit. I, I, I see you there. I, I, I didn't want to interrupt uh, Professor Tolly there. Um, how have you been? Uh, I'm doing okay. Um... Uh, Exploring another lab. Um, I seem to. I've gotten past the frustrating bit. It seems, <laughs> and and f getting some actual uh, exploration uh, properly done here. Uh, match keys. Okay, let's try match keys. Connection air reboot required. Resuming auto mode. Performing systems check. Whoa. Oh, this is the biodome. <laughs> Local area network connected at ten megabytes per second. And this is in this is in the eighties. Ten megabytes per second. That's that's a, a an insane speed um, at, in the eighties. I mean, this, this is the day of uh, when the internet was connected by phone lines. Well, actually, no, sorry, eighty. Uh, when did the internet come about? It would have been the nineties. Um, I guess I, I, the internet may not have existed at the time that this this uh, this takes place. Now that I think about it. I mean, the, the year was established. Was wasn't wasn't the year was wasn't the year established just nineteen ninety? Shoot. Like the internet was in its infancy. Um, back then, it would, it, this would be like it would be like one megabyte per five minutes. <laughs> that's not five megs per minute. That's that's uh, <laughs> one megabyte per five minutes. Like if you had a if you were trying to download a four meg song, it would take twenty minutes. Like it was slow back then. Something like YouTube would be unthinkable. Twitch would be unthinkable. <laughs> ah! This is what Dr. Tully's uh, watching in the meantime. Okay. <laughs> I guess it's 
supposed to be like fitness programs. <laughs> they have somebody doing some exercise. Hey, there's the koi. Ah, but yeah, I, I was gonna, I was gonna comment. Sorry, uh, before I got all distracted. Uh, comment on um, on Wendell's. Uh, to talk there like it's it's rough I mean I can understand where he's coming from when he's like developing technology like first of all technology that can like shrink things like this like that's just this insane like revolutionary technology on top of all the other discoveries making about you know like modified Brussels sprouts and all that like like, how can you not be utterly fascinated and captivated by it and want to continue developing the technology, you know? But at the same time, you know, wife and kids, right? I mean, they're being neglected while he's focusing on all this. Marble shard. Ross is a science. Uh, I'm going to have to go down there now. Okay, anyway. Oh. For, for a split second there, I thought maybe there was there's glass blocking it. And, uh... Oh. Oh, hey. It's this place. Uh, oh wait, there's no point in pursuing my inventory is full. Um, okay, let's just. Oh. Yeah, I guess I'll take this guy out. Seven thirteen p.m. How did the whole day go by? It was it was morning a minute ago. Anyway, um, I'm gonna uh, dash over this way. Uh, I want to head over to lab entrance there. Um, yeah, inventory is pretty full here. Is there... Why aren't these stacked? There. Easy inventory resolution there. Okay, I just heard a weevil. There. My mom always says I light up a room. <laughs> There we go. Now I can repair this darn thing. There you go. Um, and that way. Uh, I'd be a very rich person if he sold the research. Hmm, yeah. But, I mean, I get the definite feeling for him. Uh, it's not about the money. He's just utterly fascinated by everything that he's discovering and he just wants more and more and he can't get enough of it like I, I get the, the feeling that it's, it's not about the money for him uh, okay ASL terminal more infusion upgrades and uh, yeah, 
Mega Muff Molar. Conceivable stack size, here we go. Confuse group. Oops, new quest available. Complete trail marks at Sandcastle Tower. Ooh, actually, I'll take that because um, I need to go to the uh, the the, uh, the, uh, the 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 sandbox next. I think. I mean, after I'm done in the pond lab and stuff. First, uh, let's give Burgle the chip and see what he has to say. Always happy to see a repeat customer. Mm -hmm. Can I help you today? I found another super chip. I knew I could count on you. Ooh. Please hold while I update my file. Here we go. Processing. Processing. Let's wait for Boom. Better than ever. My diagnostic module is now restored. Analysis shows the spacer suffered a Catastrophic failure in the embiggening cell. <laughs> embiggening cell. This this was before that Simpsons episode that, that created the term embiggens. <laughs> did you come up with that name? Uh, did you come up with that name? If only. Sadly, I can only explain its function. Fine. The embiggening cell stores and regulates interatomic energy transfer during the spacing expansion phase of the spacer. Hmm. Okay. Put simply, it controls the rate of growth of the subject and prevents overexpansion, which can be quite messy. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I hate to think what messy means in this context. No science talk. What's the bottom line? Tell me more. <laughs> tell me more about the growth stuff. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Let's hear it. Yes. Ha. Um. If the subject's rate of growth is not precisely regulated. Overexpansion will cause bioorganic subjects, such as yourself, to pop like a gremlin in a microwave. <sighs> okay. Gremlins reference? I can get behind that. That, that movie came out in the 80s. Um, yeah. The, there is... I, it's been a long time since I watched that movie, but I do recall there being a movie... <laughs> yeah, Gremlin in a microwave. I do recall there being a scene where they... Uh, being attacked by a gremlin, he's, he's stuffed in the microwave, turns it on, and it explodes. <laughs> These pop culture references, yeah. Er, scientifically speaking, <laughs> of course. Okay, no science like what's the bottom line. Uh, what does this all mean? There is both good news and the bad news. <laughs> Which would you like to have first? Good news, bad news, surprises. Go with the bad news. The bad news is that the spare cell I have is empty. Yeah, it's to be expected. The good news was that I have a spare cell. <laughs> Empty? The cell must be filled with a special mixture. A cocktail, if you will. Another hmm. breakthrough invention by Dr. Tully. Hmm. Hold, please, while I push the recipe for the embiggening cocktail to your scabby. Oh, nice. Processing. Processing. I was, I was worried he wouldn't have the recipe. Or, wait, maybe he doesn't. Error. Yeah. Missing directory. The directory you attempted to copy does not exist. Boo doo doo, boo doo doo. <laughs> Burgle makes error sounds. So <laughs> subtitle. <laughs> he just goes boo doo doo. Cheese and fries. It appears the formula for the embiggening cocktail is not in my memory. It yeah, must be on surprise. one of the remaining super chips. Of course. We will need that recipe in order to fill the embiggening cell and send you home. Hmm. I am sorry. It seems like the forces of nature are trying to keep you in this yard, but I believe you are here for a reason. Oh, interesting. Hold on to the empty cell for me, and when you feel ready, retrieve another super chip to see if we can piece this puzzle together. Piece this puzzle together? It, it, it says piece together this puzzle. Yeah, anyway. Are there any other Ask questions? Away, my friend. No, no, no more there. How can I help you today? Thank you. Come again soon. Okay. Um, did he actually give me something? He gave me a thing. Oh yeah, I can stack these uh, higher now. There you go. More inventory space. 
Um, he said he's going to give me the empty cell. I, I don't see it in my inventory. Or does that show up somewhere else? Do you get new crafting options? There's a new thing over here. Uh, close to the ending? I, I'm i pretty sure I'm nowhere near the uh, close to the ending. There's still two more labs that I need to explore, and uh, I get the feeling there's there's other stuff going on. Um, oh, muscle sprout, there you go. Edible hybrid Brussels sprouts, treatment, yeah, I already read that. Useful for enhancing smoothies. So I can... Uh, Hmm, you can put it in the smoothie machine, I guess. Retrieve the next super chip. Processing. Processing. Any new options here? Buoyant foundation. Floating surface perfect for supporting structures built over water. Oh, we can build structures over water. That's kind of neat. Nice and clean. Curved bases. Curved cell floor can be used as a ceiling. I haven't really been doing any base building beyond just building the... Uh, You know, the base construction, uh, the, yeah, anyway, cookbook pot. Oh, here we are. Fine fin soup made from ethically sourced boatman fins. <laughs> Hard enough to be considered a whole meal. So it increases swim speed. Acorn sp spaghetti flea. <laughs> made from uh, water flea meat, I presume. Acorn bits combined with lily pad wax and form a perfectly unique rendition of this classic dish, completed by an assortment of water flea meatballs. Tadpoloka pudding. Surprisingly creamy blend of water based ingredients with a bit of a chill from an ice cap's breath mint. Oh, huh. So increased swim speed, increased junior diver plus veteran diver plus swim speed. Okay. Uh, I'm going to come back to check on these in a moment because my water. Speaking of water flea, my water flea meat is about to go bad, but if I cook it, that resets its timer, so let me just go run over here and cook it real quick. Oh, there you go. I got Now I got the embiggening cell. This weird delay before I actually got the thing that he supposedly gave me. I'll just cook these all up. Hmm. Achieve the next super chip. Hmm. Uh, probably need to wait till you get the recipe for the cocktail, then you get the empty cell. Uh, well, I mean, it, I just had a little pop up said re received the empty cell, so I'm not sure where it displays. Like, I don't see it in my, displayed in my inventory or anything. Maybe I'm looking at the wrong screen. Maybe it's in the data screen. Purple. Got two chips. We got a regular chip. Or is it these are recordings? Stuff. I'm beginning cell. There you go. Empty replacement embiggening cell that requires the embiggening cocktail in order to work in the spacer. Okay. <laughs> scabby user manual. Tired of manual fills and for interacting with the scabby on your wrist, plus a lot of oddly specific information about yard survival. Shortcuts to the manual are found on the pause and death screens. <laughs> Funny. Okay, anyway, I want to finish looking at the, those new options that I got. I'm trying to double click on this. Anyway, science at science. Turret pollen? A stationary turret that requires manual operation lobs pollen nuggets at flying enemies to help bring them to the ground. Deals extra damage against creatures involved in defense events. Oh, interesting. Mm. 
Well, I mean, I guess I'll get the cookbook pond stuff, even though I honestly... It also seems unlikely I'm going to get those. I'm going to use them, I mean. I haven't... You know, I don't know about building this stuff. I, um... I can get the pollen turret. Could be fun. Let's give it a shot. Hmm? <laughs> anyway. Uh, let's move right along. Um... These in slot eight and this in slot seven. And uh, yeah, I got four free inventory slots. Let's go. Let's go resume the exploration, I guess. Although maybe I should. Okay, what time is it? Uh, it's like two a.m. Um, I'm gonna take a short jaunt back to home base. Oh frick. Uh that's a that's a wolf spider. Oh come on. Jerk. Yeah, he he stun locked me and I couldn't I couldn't move. <laughs> Fortunately my uh I set the spawn point right over here, which is like just a few centimeters away. Unfortunately, that means that I have to wait. Oh, that's an orb weaver. That's not the wolf spider. Uh, the bone dagger's all right. Ah, oh, it's damaged now. Great. Uh, well, given the choice between using the damaged version of that and damaged that, let's let's get the spider fang dagger out again. Um. Hey, first time chatter. Uh, sorry, bear with me. Uh, I just fell into water and I can't see anything. Uh, uh, Kalater, welcome to the stream. Thanks for stopping by. How's it going? Wolf spiders are no joke. <laughs> yeah. This 
Is that where is that where is that from? That that, that phrase "giant spiders are no joke." I mean, there, there's a. Um, it's a phrase used in uh, one of the scenes in FTL, uh, and I'm I'm told that was a reference to something, but I'm not sure what's a reference to. Yoink. Bit of extra meat for the road. It's okay, just just cow? Okay, cool. How's it going, Cal? Uh, friggin' giant spiders. <laughs> uh, let's keep moving. Uh, I'll repair up my daggers when I get back. What now? Not another orb weaver. Uh. Rather not fight another spider right now, thanks. Let me just I can just run right past you. That'd be great. <laughs> Good. Yep. It's cool. It's cool. Yeah. Just uh, just playing a bit of grounded here. It's my first time playing. It's the survival crafting game where you're you're tiny, and uh, these are all blades of grass here. You have to face giant insects and arachnids and stuff. It's pretty fun. It's 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 had its uh, an uncomfortable. I'm gonna say an uncomfortable number of uh, frustrating moments, but uh, overall, uh, I'm, I'm I'm curious to see where it goes. I mean, from the dive from the plate, and there you go. Yoink. Uh, let's let's repair this up. And let's also repair this up. Actually, no. Um, rather than use up my limited supply of venom to repair it, I do believe if I run it through this thing and give it an upgrade I believe that like auto repairs it right yeah good as new maybe they can do the same thing with this uh, although before I do that let me just uh, uh, do you need help with the game I played it oh, okay uh, I think I'm doing okay for the moment um, I, I have had moments where I felt like I needed help uh, to be honest, but I uh, I, I think I'm uh, on the right track to uh, to make real progress now, so it's it's all good. Um, shoot, what was I doing? Oh, what's all this? Oh, we got new construction options. Oh yeah, tadpole loca pudding, boatman fin soup, Sp spaghetti flea instead of spaghetti. Yeah, and there's the pollen turret. Could be neat. I actually have all the ingredients. I just need to get some uh, some weed stems. And there's something new over here. What's what's this exclamation mark about? What new thing did I get? Oh, ta oh tadpole jerky. Yeah. Cool. Um, there's nothing new to scan, right? Like the yeah, the doesn't the doesn't let me scan the breath the, the muscle sprouts. Anyway, um, yeah, I I'm uh, th thanks for the offer, Cal. I just uh, I generally uh, like to try to figure things out for myself. Um, but uh, yeah, if I if I uh, decide I need some assistance, I'll let you know. Ah, good big pile of quartzite shards and marble shards. That's awesome. I can do lots of upgrades. Uh, and up 
upgrade the bone dagger. 10%? Should I upgrade it now or should I uh, wait until it's damaged? And Because uh, upgrading it also repairs at the same time, so I can like save resources by repairing and upgrading at the same time. Throw the muscle sprouts in here, I guess. Oh, I ran out of room for the for the whetstones. Okay. And the lily pad wax. Ah. Okay. All right. Um, let's cook up the aphid. Uh, yes, but it is, is more worth to upgrade. Uh, okay, yeah, fine. I guess I can do that. Um, I'll, I'll give them, I'll upgrade them to 15%. Once I'm done with the, uh, the water area. I don't know how much use I'm going to get out of the bone dagger, but I think it's good to keep around. Level 4, level 3, level 4. Uh, I think I might just do regular repairs for those. Oh yeah, I need some water. Yoink. Nice and clean. I refilled the canteen, right? Yeah. Um... Shoot, getting distracted. What's I gonna do? Oh yeah. Um, what needs? Okay, sunken so bone. Yes, okay, that's that's fine. I can I can uh, I can spare that. That's fine. What's need for this water bowman with lily pad wax? That's cool. Uh, what the hey? Let's let's repair these guys up while I'm at it. I need to repair the gas mask. I'm gonna to want to go into the uh, into the um, bombardier parts. Uh, those, are little, those are a little harder to come by. Maybe I'll hold off in repairing that. But yeah, I'm gonna to want to go to the haze lab uh, eventually. Um, work shoes. So, so you would want to approve again to repair it. Um. Sorry, I'm not sure what you were saying there. Want to prove again to repair it? Yeah, not sure. That's sorry, I'm not sure what you meant by that. Uh, but I'm gonna get myself another torch plus and another slime lantern. Oh, requires requires workbench to craft. Okay. Do I need a new quest? Oh yeah, I, I didn't have a new, uh, done with the quest that I took on. Um, yeah, where's the stepping stone summit? I took on that quest because I thought I knew where it was and it wasn't there, uh, or at least I didn't see it. Might need to explore some more. I'm gonna take on. Let's, let's, let's see if we can finish off the the red soldier ant thing. Because since I'm in the neighborhood for it. I just need to get some more uh, more healing items first. Aphids. Here's an aphid. Ah, the animation stuttered and I lost sight of them. Yeah, let's get some weevils instead. That's fine. Get out of the way. <laughs> Let's 
right there. Where'd the aphid? I was just letting it go. Aphids or weevils around? Yeah, whatever. Maybe this is enough to get by with. The trouble is, if I go after the the soldier ants again, I'm sure that all the worker ants are going to swarm me just like last time. Having some extra healing sources would be good. Yoink, yoink. That slot number seven. Yeah, whatever, I'll wing it. Oh, right. Uh, I'm still wearing the bubble helmet. I should be wearing... Ah. Take out a couple of uh, couple of soldier ants. Okay, there's a soldier ant. It's in amongst all all her sisters. So so uh, preferably I'd like to be able to separate one out from the others if possible. But they're just soldier ants don't really venture away from the hill, uh, so ant crossing. this seems like a bad idea. Two out of five. And get this get this soldier ant quest done and out of the way. Um, the last second I was uh, I reached for the spider dagger, but I realized that the spider dagger was no longer in that slot because I upgraded it and said, Oh, it's a different thing now, so it that doesn't count. But the uh, stabby weapon is better anyway. Because they're because uh, the soldier ants are, are vulnerable to stabbing rather than slashing, so it worked out. Isolated their pushovers. Uh oh. I think I pissed her off. As long as I don't fight back, uh, it won't aggro all the rest of the ants. They just, uh, they don't, they don't like witnessing me, uh, 
witnessing the attack. Hey. Any more soldier ants about? Oh, you're persistent. Really? You gonna chase me all this way? I just aggroed another one. Whatever. I can do some more red ant parts. I can, I can fix up my. Uh... Hey, Mr. Ant. Miss Ant, they're sisters. Ant crossing. Ants are sterile females. I mean, ro ant spotted. worker ants and soldier ants. Oh, soldier ants spotted? There we go. That's what I'm here for. Just need to get two more of them and I get that quest done. This is shorter telegraph of moves. Okay, just need one more soldier ant. Hey! Ooh, that was a critical hit. There you go. Raw, so this is a science. Hey, he has an acid gland? I didn't know you get those from soldier ants. That's neat. Now that I've attacked them at their home, are they are I gonna get one of those payback events? I did see a dead aphid next to the anthill. I, I meant I was thinking of running over there and picking it up, but eh. Ah, oh, well, it's fine. Have I stopped healing? Use another bandage. Anyway, uh, okay, so it's 1 p.m. I think. Oh, right, yeah, let's just drop all these uh, ant parts in here. Don't need to be carrying those around with me. Um, and everything else is like, eh, whatever. There you go, you got a good, decent supply of. Uh, food, um, I'm going to take a slight detour over to the board with a nail in it, because <laughs> that's where I set up the, uh, oh right, uh, actually before I do anything else, I want to reset my respawn point, but yeah, uh, dash over to the board with a nail in it, because that's where I uh, set the, the wolf spider mount. I can, uh... Where's the crow? I keep hearing it. Hmm. Hmm. Don't even need to boil it. Anyway. Oh. <laughs> 
three nat fuzz. Woo. And nat eight. We could do with some more nat fuzz. Nat fuzz is a bit annoying to collect. Oh yeah, I want to make more arrows. Ah. Frig, okay. I keep doing that. Like, I set out to go on some journey, some adventure, and then I get partway out, and I'm like, oh, right, that thing that I forgot. And then I go out again, and I come back, it's like, oh, right, that thing I forgot. Anyway, I want to make more arrows. Because I wouldn't say I exactly have a shortage of them, but I would feel better if I had more. We got 56 right now. Bring that up to 76. That's the number of trombones at the big parade. <laughs> 76 trombones. However that song goes. The papyrus and rose of the finest virtue. If I do this, yeah, it puts, as always, it puts the wrong torch in place. Anyway, um, is my mount still here? Yeah, it is. Wolf oh, spider mount. So, put that to you. Like I activated it, but it doesn't—it doesn't display. It doesn't display the same way that uh, the orb weaver. Uh, like the orb weaver, when you activate the orb weaver mount. It shows, uh, there's a little display showing um, enhanced damage against orb weavers. It doesn't have that same display for the wolf spider mount for some reason. spiders at once. I'm trying to back out. Can't see where I'm going. I'm just trusting that the way out is behind me. <laughs> there we are. I was trying. Uh, oh, frick, all the other food that I nice and clean. was getting ready to cook up around my body, and I have to go over there and pick it up. I should make a roasting spit there, over there. Anyway, my intent was to get his attention, lure him out. And circle around on top of the, uh, the board itself. 
so I can pelt them with, with arrows from above, like I did before. I mean, the last time I attempted that, it didn't go so well. Um, but last time I had weaker weapons. Uh, this time I have a spider, fa spider fang dagger. I have an improved bow. I expect I should be able to fare better against him. But I started to move in the direction, and the same thing happens. The same thing happened that always happens that I got stuck on some random nothing that was in my way. I don't know, there, there's, um... Let's, let's, let's make a roasty spit here. <laughs> it's a lot of, uh... A lot of weevils. Might as well repair the shield, I guess. <sighs> I'm gonna try again. Just once more. And then I'll say screw it and uh <laughs> after I inevitably fail I will I will say screw it and move on back to the pond lab. Where I was working before. It's just that if, if the spider venom is needed to repair the spider fang dagger, it would be nice if I had some more of that to stockpile for the time for whenever it needs to be repaired. I mean, I could just fall back on the larva spike. It. it like the spider fang dagger, it doesn't do so much more damage that I can look at it and go, oh, that is definitely worth that, that is definitely worth the extra hassle. So, um, I had the, uh, I had the torch out when I should have had the shield out. My bad. I said I was going to give up after that, but since I screwed up in a stupid way, maybe I, I think maybe I'll make one more attempt at it. I mean, being forced to make my retreat in the dark because I have to have the shield out instead of the, uh... Let's get the little lean-to here, what the hell? Oh, right, I need to recover my body first. The body's way the hell in there. Oh, great. That's that's just lovely. My mom always says I light up a room. Let's activate the wolf spider mount, even though... It's not clear if it's doing anything. Right where I left you. Now that I've recovered the components... make the lean-to here. I have a feeling my 
might regret this, but there, respawn point set. Okay, one last time. So I've got all these healing items. I want to put them to use. Okay, before I do that, let's ready the shield ahead of time. Here we go. Does it does it enhance the the attacks and their AI? Over time or something? I thought I lost you. Like I swear, I swear, like the earlier times previous times that I, I faced down those damn wolf spiders, they didn't do that quadruple attack. Now they're doing, he's doing a quintuple attack. <sighs> you know what, screw that. I'm just, let's just go on back to the pond lab, finish up there. stuff I'm carrying. Carrying no less than nine healing items. What is that? Oh, it's a larva. Yeah, sometimes they make two attacks, they're so just like that. I come to. Whatever works. Uh, I need more sprigs. Uh, probably pick up some sprigs on my way. centimeters away. I just want to get over to that the lean to that's there and reset my spawn point. What time is it? Ah, it's only 8 p.m. I might as well sleep till morning then. Although that means my if I go sleep if I hit the sleep till morning button then all this food that I collected goes to waste. So I'd rather not have to do that. Maybe I should go, uh, just go seek out the lab entrances that I found in the dark. I got two slime lanterns. They should, they should last for that purpose. <laughs> Inventory is full already here. That's get this way. Get... Oof, my armor took a real heckin' beating there. Yeesh. Um. 
inventory is uncomfortably full. Uh, can I um, just stash some extraneous things in the little basket that I have here? Oh, afraid. Darn it. Didn't actually want to jump over this. There we go. Keep doing that. Okay, I don't need to carry that around with me. Let's see some that fuzz in here too. Let's see if the ask one. Leave the larva spike. Any other stuff I want to leave in here? <laughs> Weevil noses, sure. That's fine. I'm not going to bother cooking up that weevil meat. I want it to repair the shield. Anyway, let's go check out these uh... Oh, tiger ready. It's doing its job. Uh, sorry, what's, what's doing its job? I, 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 you probably you probably typed that uh, right after I, I did something to refer to it, and now I'm being dense. I don't remember what I said. <laughs> anyway, um, all right. Head on over and to that entrance there. The armor? Oh, okay, yeah. Hello? Yeah, you'll just swim on past here. Yeah, I don't even need to bother with you. Is he still following me? He's still playing the music. There's the koi. That's lovely. He's right. He's right where I'm uh, heading. Anyway, here's the fountain, and underneath the fountain is the lab entrance, which I marked. And there was a locked door through here. Maybe that door is not locked now. That is the hope. Okay, it is not locked. This is a good thing. Oh wait, no, it was the door that was through here that was locked. Gosh darn it, okay. This is an Andrew key card, okay. Mm, that's how it goes. It do be like that, I guess. As the saying goes. Uh, let's eat the one that's about to spoil. Hey guys. Um, okay, well. Let us head in the direction of the next one that I marked. Um, mark one way over there. So let's go check that out. Hope no one hears thalassophobic. <laughs> it's uh you can see what is that glowing red thing there? Is that the is that the lab entrance that, that I marked? Yeah, okay. 
it's it's part of the lab. Here's the entrance. Uh, should I? I should probably refresh oxygen before check that out. Okay. Combining thalassophobia with arachnophobia, underwater spiders. This is luck too. And this also requires assistant manager key card. Gosh darn it. Well, when I finally find that assistant manager key card, wherever it is, um, I'm going to have a lot of locked doors to look up. Okay, what else is there? I mean, there were a number of entry points. This is one, I think I came out of this one earlier. This leads into the biodome, if I'm not mistaken. What that means. Did I finish exploring this area? Like, yeah, here's the biodome. I open that, right? It's empty, yeah. So that seems to be the only door. Up here is where I found all the mussel sprouts. And the super ship. This is back the way I came. I mean, back the way I came the first time around. And let me just get my bearings. I think this leads back through the the bed thing there. Yeah. What's in here again? I think this is just some some extra thread. Uh, pass on that. Did I go through this door? Hmm? Let there be light. Nothing in here. Okay. You know what the purpose of that was? What about this one? Right. I. I do believe, okay, I think this leads, or where does this lead? Maybe I did go in here. Okay, yeah, this is full of meat. Yeah, all the food. Yep, I know where this is. So this is just, um... Like, the sign on that thing... Biodome Auto Mode Reboot Biodome Terminal. I reboot the, the Biodome Terminal, and that's done with. Biodome Hat... Like biodome Access Ramp on Hatch. Um, That just leads back down to the alternate way in, which I've already explored, I think. He's still splashing around everywhere in ankle deep water. Like, this is. This is the place of eternal wet socks. Ugh. Oh, nothing worse than wet socks. So, I think this whole biodome region thing is all totally explored. I don't think there's... doesn't look like there's anything else here. Uh, I 
think there was another entry point to explore, though, wasn't there? There's one more that I marked over here. There's also still a missing burgle chip here. Shoot. Okay, well, I'll come back here. Uh, got too many markers now. Uh, that's... 49 centimeters. Okay, let's check that out. As well, and hey, there's there's the biodome. You can see in, into it from above. That's kind of neat. Where? There you are. Oh, well, maybe I don't feel like dealing with you right now. So I I put that marker on the surface there. On the lily pad. <laughs> that was a water flea coming at me. There's a marker. Let's see if I can find the entrance that I marked here. That it should be roughly underneath it. I, I seem to recall it wasn't directly underneath, it was somewhere in the, near, in the vicinity because I wasn't able to mark it directly. swings uncomfortably slowly underwater, which makes sense, I mean... There's a lot more resistance to swinging something underwater than compared to swinging it through the air. Uh, so it makes sense that I can swing slowly. Still annoying, though. Is this what I marked? It, it looks like... Each one I kill it refreshes the oxygen, so <laughs> they at least stay down here longer. So it's whatever. Excuse me? Like, sure, whatever, I'll get some, some more diving bell spider parts.
I don't mind having some, more, some spare Diving Bell spider parts. Why not? Which one is closest to spoil? Okay, these guys are close to, close to spoil. Eat them first. Anyway, um, that's my marker up there, 66 centimeters away. Oh, there you are. I knew there was one spider which I hadn't collected yet. Um, where is this room in relation to the facility? Did I even find a door connected with it? Looks like there are two branches in either direction. Maybe I never found... Okay, here it is. <laughs> Maybe I never found it. Oh, there it is. <laughs> and the door is still locked. That resource analyzer. Locked! How dare! This one doesn't. Like, this one doesn't even have the assistant manager keycard thing that I couldn't find. It just. It just says locked. This just ha this one has no obvious mechanism to open it. Okay, it's just uh, this game is pissing me off. All those things that I activated to open doors, open doors, and it still hasn't opened all the doors. <sighs> okay. Anyway, um. According to this, I accomplished all the goals. <sighs> but, uh... Now we're into the next day. Yeah, at 6 a.m. <sighs> okay. Um... Hmm. Like, what am I missing? Don't even need to boil it. You know, like, I guess I said before, it's, it's fine, they want to pace their story, they want to spread things out, yada yada yada, it's fine, it's fine, but... It's... Uh... Like, I mean, I mean, like, that aspect of it is fine, in theory, but... pipe go anywhere? Just goes into the ground? Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. There's so much of this game, it just feels like I'm bashing my head against um, locked doors that I can't figure out how to open. Some water probes and pins on here. Which coincidentally also refreshes my oxygen. Okay, so presumably that hallway leads to that thing there. Uh, there's another hallway this way. Does this lead to another entrance? And the answer is probably not. It's probably the only way in there. How do you open it? I mean, I already opened the biodome. I accessed every terminal in the place. I, I, I went to all the places I can imagine might have, have some means of opening that. Grabbing some tadpole meat because my uh, my food is spoiling. I, it's it's playing the food spoiling sound effects. Of 
approaching two and a half hours into this stream, by the way. Get another water pump of opportunity. So here's the flingman again. Is there anything underneath it? No. Okay. I got the, the gold card for the boatman, for the water boatman. How about that? Oh, do I still have the oh, I still have the torch in hand? It isn't using up the torch, is it? This is the uh, is the entrance to that thing there. Well, it's daytime. There's daylight. Um, it's a good time to explore. Here we go. Also fill up on uh, on uh, tadpole meat. Um, is this is this the one I marked? I think so. I'm gonna check it anyway. Let's me refresh oxygen. If nothing else. Yeah, this is the one that I was just looking at. Okay. Just, just checking. Be sure. This is the the ring. point there, entry point here. I've already checked those out. Let's take a trip up to my spit here. My roasting spit. But to spoil, let's let's use it to repair the shield for spoils, and let's cook up tadpoles. These guys that are about to spoil, um, probably just ditch them. You definitely ditch this one, which is already spoiled. <sighs> and I can feel myself getting irritated uh, by the design of the game, but I'm still continuing with it anyway. This is me being a bit of a masochist. I don't know. Maybe I'm my own worst enemy. <laughs> Continuing with the game even though it's uh, <laughs> finding it frustrating. Oh well. Hey look, it's Trudy too. <laughs> Does she actually have only one eye? I wonder. <laughs> anyway, um, 
I'm curious about this burglar. Yeah, it's right under me. Sorry. I heard Trudy too, and then it made that made me nervous. Oh, there she is. <laughs> Don't know if that's actually her name. <laughs> of uh, Wendell's madness. This leads to the uh, the T-Rex, yeah. Reoxygenate and then we'll continue down here. Because, yeah, like the spot where The spot where the burgled ship was is clearly underground. Um, I'm wondering if there's something I missed somewhere. Like here, this entry point this is so far away from the sunken T-Rex. Like I wonder if I can make my way there. Like this, this facing is in the direction of the burgled ship, but hmm. Okay, so if I go through the door here and this way, slit leads to where the biodome is. It says, a, it says Pond Dome. It's all brightly lit. Now that it's, now that it's open and it's daytime, it's kind of neat. Now I go over here. Hmm. Oh, shoot. This just leads to the way out. Hmm. Is there another entry point that I'm missing? I just went right past it. Like, according to this, it's right in front of me. It's got to be underground as part of the lab. Or wouldn't it be funny if it was like just sitting there on the end of this twig or something? Um, like, I don't think it's on top of the lily pad above me, right? Wouldn't that be a heck of a hiding place? I mean, the map is a top-down view. Is arguably it could be possible for it to be like sitting on top of the leaf here. But uh, nope. <laughs> I 
you know, and part of me is going, ah, you know, screw it. Maybe I should just look up, uh, you know, look up walkthroughs. But like that, uh, that screwy walkthrough, which gave me wrong information, is making me uh, wary about that. I don't know. Um, well, this all seems to connect up with each other, um, except there there is. I think there there was that one entrance which didn't seem to connect up with the rest of it, and it was locked. Um, so I don't know. Maybe, maybe the way to the other burgle chip is through the locked door, but how do I unlock it? I don't know. Like maybe I should just maybe I should just have a walkthrough open on the other monitor uh, at all times at this point because like the the, the like the way forward might be uh, non obvious due to just bad design choices, you know, like that the other that other hatch thing. Oh, is that the scabby I see? Or scabby scheme shallows. Oh. Marble shard I missed. I don't know. I don't know, I don't know. Um that door leads to the way out. This leads back in here. This leads to this sort of central hub of a place here. It's back down here. Could it be like on the ground in between here and the T-Rex or something like that? Oh, wait, is it inside the chest? Oh, you know what? That's probably it. Hold on. That little toy chest that I saw that ha said it needs the mossy key. I'll bet that's it. Where is the mossy key? Who knows? Oh, is that what I think it is? Yeah, I'll collect that, I guess. Get rid of these things. Because I'm, uh, yeah. It's like I get carried away here. I don't have a lot of this oxygen. I've got a fair bit of oxygen. and then I'll head back. Bloop. And collect the koi scales and sunken bones because I can. 
the Trudy Two scales. There's some good sound design here, by the way. Like the the sound of the impact, and also the sound of the, uh, the thing being dislodged. They're uh, they're satisfying sounds. They sound like they should sound. Yeah, right on top of it. Here, yeah, this is it. Mossy key. I just need to find the mossy key wherever that is. The question is, is the mossy key in its region somewhere, or is it somewhere else and I have to come back here? Like, for all I know, the mossy key is... Uh, like by the haze lab or by the, the black ant lab. Or it could be a super secret thing, what do I know? Oh great. Friggin' Trudy too. Does again does, does she have just one eye? Whatever. Um, I think it's time to be done with this area, and let's uh, A way out. There's a. I know somewhere around here there's a twig. There it is. A twig which you climb on to get back up onto those rocks. Canteen, and then we're gonna move on to the uh, another area, I guess. Considering that apparently pushing you brings up to the third person view, I'm surprised I don't push that button by accident more often. For instance, I is right next to you. Sounds like a bad pickup line. I, I put you and I together. <laughs> or something. Anyway. Um, yeah, let's just head back. I'll carry the. Um, might fuzz and Matt fugs back with me. Um, but one more inventory slot. Larva spike? Acid glands? Go with the larva spike. Yeah, that'll do. Should I try taking on the uh, wolf spider one more time? I have more arrows this time. Um, I'm a little 
safe now. I'll make I'll give it a whirl. Is that two wolf spiders? On the fact back pack space to yeah. Quick both hands. Um I don't need a thread, I guess. It's easily acquired. 71 arrows. <laughs> it keeps throwing me. He's try trying to jump out and he partially clips through the leaf and without actually being able to pass through it. Just need to find a good angle. I can hit him. So he can't actually jump up here. that right angle that I can get him to a comfortable rhythm. Just like that. Fifty-three arrows left. Is that enough to take him out? How'd that arrow miss? How did that arrow heckin' miss? halfway through the arrows. Like, am I hitting, am I hitting the leaf, or is it just overshooting him entirely? Charge, which unfortunately means he might get a bit of healing back. I can't afford to miss. Nine arrows left. Like, even cheesing these guys, they are so tanky. Detected Mithridism? Oh, it upgraded. Inventory full. I 
can't. Oh, right. Um, eat these out of the way. Mm. Salt. The ad loot. Um, get the torch out. I didn't lose anything, did I? Did, did I get all the spider parts to be had? Spider fang and the spider venom? Okay, I got We've got 70 arrows. That's cool. So if the spider taken out, does that mean... Uh... There's a second wolf spider. <laughs> um, I think maybe one is enough <laughs> for today. I can feel some measure of vindication having uh, successfully taken out one spider. Let's just get back. Also, let's get the spider bang dagger ready. Hey, it's already half gone. Did I even really use it that much? Ladybug. Hmm. Try to avoid the spiders if I can. On the way back, Oop. I didn't actually want that one. Let's just try to get these things stacked up to fifteen. There you go. Almost there. No water filtration tablets needed. Twenty one forty seven. Um we probably just spend the night then. Um uh, set a respawn point before I forget. Um Was there something I wanted to, uh... Well, let's... Put these things to use. Well, these things, this thing. And then deposit all the things. to repair the band armor, that's what I put it. That shouldn't go bad by the time the morning rolls around, right? I hope. 
Oh, another dream sequence? This is him waking up after being shrunk, perhaps? Body mass readout is an acceptable range. Skin fold degradation is minimal. Specimen vitals are stable and holding. Looks like we've done it. Great job, everyone. Let's set up three more trials for replication. <laughs> uh, sorry to crash your party. The Defense Department has arrived early to discuss Project Orc. The director needs you to be present at the meeting. <sighs> Not sure what's worse, our director or a three-hour meeting with the military. Hmm. More nightmare visions. I was the subject of a nefarious science experiment, but to what end? Orcs are minions of Lurk and Shriek. Hmm, the quest becomes even more mysterious. Uh, didn't we establish what orcs stood for at some point? One of the ominent is compliance officer, intern, special forces. Orc project. Like uh, for the orc operation. Did did he ever establish what orc stood for? Can't remember. Yeah. Hmm. Yoink! 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 Um. Any quests of note? Find the Tasteful Ascent Burgle Chip. Tasteful Ascent Burgle Chip? I guess 2,500 raw science points. That seems like a lot. And anyway, um, you know, I'll accept it. it. Seems like something I'm going to have to get at some point regardless. Might as well get some extra bonus raw science points out of it. Why not? Um, yeah, I should probably be tracking down, like, I, I got these Burgle chips mapped out. This one needs the mossy key, apparently. There's so much over here that I haven't mapped out yet. I haven't figured out how to get up here yet. Huh. Yeah, at some point. Uh, this is on top of the picnic table. Hmm. I haven't been in the sandbox yet. Maybe I can try for that next, or, or maybe I... Uh, maybe that's something is better left for another day. Um... There's a super tech chip right here, and I found an entry point, but I, I think... Hmm. Don't even need to boil it. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Um... Yeah, that's slot seven. Yeah, okay. Um, take these and make more. How much silk rope is in here? <laughs> Keep adding more to it and it keeps accepting it. Um, why don't I take one unit of venom with me in case I want to repair my... Uh, Spider Fang dagger out in the field, and uh, we've got the uh, the gas mask handy, right? Ah, uh, you know, I 
Come to think of it, uh, one of the things that Darkness said in chat at one time um, was that there was uh, access to some means of stockpiling healing that that comes from uh, the pond lab. Uh, I don't remember encountering any such thing. I think it may it might have. It might have been referring to one of the um, uh, they, they, they might have been referring to uh, one of one of the um, the recipes that I got with the the muscle sprouts. I don't like do muscle sprouts. Yeah, oh, hello. Yoink. <laughs> Still provides fun with growth. You could try taking on. Uh, Try taking on the, uh, the infected ladybug. I'm feeling really bold. What's it uh, vulnerable to? Busting. That did not do much damage. where they're landing.
I'm so close. This is how this always goes. This is where he kills me. Oh, that's right next to me. I'm trying to stay away from the explosives. I'm stuck. <sighs> that was kind of nuts. What do I got? What do I got? Ladybug part, ladybug head, fungal growth. Fungal growth from six. I mean... Okay. Took out an infected ladybug. That was a feat. In itself. It's not what I set out to do here exactly. Was that easier than taking out a regular ladybug? Lodged in them or something? Like those things make you. There you go. There it is. They make you drop it. It seems. Uh. Anyway. Um. You're gonna be arrows, it's literally I'm gonna be finding arrows for weeks here. <laughs> You're just littered all over the place, because I, I was my battle with the ladybug was all over the place. Amazing, I got as many as sixty-two of them back. There's one up here? That's where the broken pipe is. I'm gonna go over to the broken pipe, because, um, as I was starting to say, and then I got distracted and interrupted and stuff. Where, things that Darkness said was that uh, there is a uh, get these guys uh, one of the things that Darkness said was that, was that there was uh, another way from the broken pipe I don't know if I mean like there's, if there's another Another broken pipe that I missed, or uh... oh shoot, um... oh heck, ah oh, darn. Okay, right. um, just bandages for now. Let's cook these up when I whenever I get the chance. Um. A roasting spit over there. I mean, I can just make another roasting spit. It's not a big deal. If I'm gonna make it, I might as well put it somewhere I'll be able to find later. Let's put it next to the broken pipe. Anyway, yeah, uh, Darkness is saying that next to the. Hmm? 
What was that? I just heard. Bug loot, water damaged, okay. I mean, I thought I explored the area uh, within the pipe. I didn't see anything note there, but... Uh, Anyway, uh, where can I? Can't put it on this rock? Time two forty four at five PM. And that mean eighth of me will take tie me over for the time being. Um oh, I was about to switch to the, the bubble helmet that I realized oh wait, I can't do that when uh a little less squishy now. When I'm out in the middle of uh, the haze. Okay, well, maybe once I get in here, now can I swap to it? Yeah, because going this way, this is just totally blocked off, right? Nothing here. Like, is there another pipe that uh, they were referring to? Because they said that, that if, I, if I go the other way down the pipe, that it leads somewhere else. But, like, there's only one way to go here. Right? This is the only path to go. Is that a critical hit? They only took one hit. Which reminds me, I meant, to, I meant to put these in the hotbar. There we go. So I entered this area, and there are two ways to go. Um, I think I explored all this, didn't I? Like, this leads to a dead end, right? Uh. Wow, triple kill. And I have 70 seconds of oxygen. Uh, <laughs> a little too nice. <laughs> uh, so I'm gonna, uh, let's just quick head back and re-oxygenate before I proceed forward. Like, is there another pipe? Or is there actually something that I'm missing here? I did already look this way in the previous session. I should have. Oh. 
inventory full. Ah, darn it. Um, just eat that up. Oh, the game just freeze. There we go. Okay. It's like this is a dead end. This, by all appearances, is a dead end. Nothing here. And, and I did, you know, already explore this. A couple of quartzite shards I missed. So that's cool. Of course, they start to uh, respawn. Stand is getting low. Got a little more than 30 seconds of uh, oxygen, but that's fine. The stamina recharge is pretty quick. Should I cook these guys up while I'm here? Yeah, I'll probably be fine. I'll, uh... It makes more sense to wait for the for them to degrade a bit before cooking them anyway. Uh, okay, so that's the way I just went. That's all explored. Water plays in here. So much extra meat. And this, this just leads back here. Just keep just got a glimpse of raw science. Did I miss something here? Did I miss some raw science over there? Need to boil it. Let's swap back to this guy. Did I miss some real sides up there? I did climb up there in the last session. I like jumped on this and then climbed up here and then these these red wires these red and black wires the monitor from the other thing uh, indicated oh hey oh whoa 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 what's happening here uh, <laughs> I got a raid what what Coders ring with a party of 14 holy moly <laughs> welcome, welcome raiders. Hey, some first time chatters here. That's awesome. Hey, thanks for the raid, Coder. Uh, how, how's your stream going? You're, you're still making your way through our castle walls, right? Gentle code raid. How's it going? Still struggling with this game. Still struggling with this game. Yeah, I, I consulted a walkthrough so I could uh, figure out where uh, I was supposed, what I was supposed to do. Turns out the other walkthrough I looked at was just plain wrong. Uh, which is a little annoying. Um, and uh, yeah, so I, I was able to explore more of that lab, open up all the doors. Um, well, shoot, okay. This is, I don't think there's anything of interest here. I already, I think I already did all this here. Um, yeah, so that was, that was, uh, I mean, I figured it out in the end. Uh, yeah. 
And uh, yeah, as for everyone uh, who just joined us, um, joined us, joined me. Um, uh, yeah, my name's Tormuse. I'm a variety streamer. Right now, I'm playing Grounded, which is a survival crafting game where you've been shrunk. You're you're tiny. And you're trying to uh, find out what's going on in this mysterious outbreak. Um, let's put the gas mask back on. Where's my gas mask? There it is. That's pretty safe. And safer. <laughs> Rob not alt. A message equals Rob's message. Raid message equals Rob's message. Grounded is a real fun game. Yes, it is a fun game. It's it can also be you know kind of frustrating. I, I'm finding. Um, but uh, eh, I'm making progress. I'm I'm getting through it gradually. Uh, seven thirty one. Can I? Oh, I can just. Set my respawn point here for the time being. Um, oh, can I, I can just sleep till morning? Why don't I just, yeah, just sleep till morning here and then. Uh, and figure out where to go next from here. Cook these up before they spoil. Um, oh, chilly, but not bad. Yeah, just eat these guys up now. They're about to spoil anyway. And just put these guys in their place. That'll work. Yeah. So I've been I've been shrunk due to some kind of mad experiment. I'm, in, I'm trapped in the backyard. These are blades of grass here. There's a house up there. Uh, in the meantime, I'm like cooking up bugs. <laughs> and while those are cooking, let me just go back to the water cooler. Yeah, and there, there's a sign. There's signs that there was some kind of um, miniaturized research team like the, the the people working here were shrunk too what they were trying to do and why is all very mysterious uh oh no no no, no. Is, that, is that a infected weevil no no uh, exploding weevils um, oh yeah, and this this region where I'm in, uh, they were conducting experiments with uh, fungus, and there was apparently also weed killer leaking, and there's just this weird contamination which is making all the bugs go crazy, uh, and it, it turned the uh, weevils into explodey weevils. <laughs> um, anyway figure out where to go next. Um, shall I check out the sandbox? Or should I... I feel like I want to check out the sandbox. I haven't checked it out so far. Uh, that's a little chasm I don't want to bother with right now. Uh, can I get up on this thing? Over here maybe? This field looks a little lower. Right there, it looks like I should be able to get on top of that. There we go. So, wad of gum underneath the deck. <laughs> there are lots of lots of little details throughout the game like that. Which I think are really neat. So that, that's the sandbox there. The walls of the sandbox are pretty high. Um, 
Don't know how I'm going to get in there. Has to be a way in there, though. One of the labs is supposedly in the sandbox. Oh, there's a hose. There's a hose going up there. Hmm. Maybe I can climb the hose. Also, I'm going to grab some sap and see if maybe I can make some bandages. Make some more bandages with that. Anything underwater? What was that? Oh, husky weed, okay. Uh, make more fiber bandages with. Just so I can have backup source of healing if need be. Yeah. Huh. I thought I was going to go into the, the sandbox, but now I'm curious about this hose. <laughs> Is there a way up there? Onto the actual porch? It's big piles of garbage here. Hey, there's a juice box there. I wonder if I can get some juice. Sandbox scares me? Oh, oh no. Uh... <laughs> Started playing when it was first released, and they have added so much real cool to see. Yeah. Great 404. Well, I gotta go. Have fun. Peace out. Oh, sure. Thanks for thanks again for stopping by. You uh, have yourself a good e good day, good evening, depending on what time zone you're in. Time zones are so confusing. No, there are no drops of juice to be had from this? No? Okay, fine. Ah, uh, well, anyway. Despite uh, Sidious's warning that uh, uh, about the scary sandbox, um, I'm. Oh, is that? Oh, are those the the black ants which I keep hearing about? Oh, there's a drop of juice. Sorry, I thought I was going to climb up into the sandbox, but then I got distracted by the black ants. So far, all, I've seen nothing but red ants. I expect if these are the black ants. I expect them to be bigger. Are the black ants significantly different from the red ants, though? Uh, oh, is that at the top there? Black worker ant. Weak to, weak to stabbing. Hardier ant that patrols outer reaches of the yard and lives in the black ant hill can drop black ant head and black ant part on death. Uh, if we him for me, but it feels like 2 him for some reason. Hmm. You know how to get into the sandbox. Uh, nope, I have never gone in there before. Um, climbing up that hose seems like a uh, seems like a good option, but I'm not sure if that will work. Um, it seems prudent to have some uh, weevil meat to repair the shield if need be. Um, don't need the weevil nose though. Should I try attacking some of these uh, black ants? That'd be a terrible idea. It's going to get the whole colony on me if I do that. I'm going for it. Oh, they really are hardier. Oh, that really is. This is the weapon. This is the weapon that he's 
vulnerable to, supposedly. Want to finish him off? There we go. Rather, rather avoid fa facing them two at a time like this. Oh, he's stunned. Frig. Focus on one. For some people, it feels like 2 a.m. It <laughs> feels actually, like actually 2 a.m. Technically, I'm closer to 3 a.m. now, but who cares? This time isn't real anyway. There's no difference. Huh. Yeah, it's always whatever time somewhere. I mean, I don't know. Different. <laughs> time is an illusion, right? All the time zones out there. Um. Anyway. Okay, got some black amparts. That's that's a new that's a new thing for me. Uh, something to analyze when I get the next get to the scanner. Whenever uh, whenever I can get it around to that. Uh, why don't I get back to the hose? Oh hey, bees around too. What's the um? What are bees weak to? Slashing. Okay. Spider fang dagger should make short work of uh, the bees if I decide to take another one on. I uh, I faced a bee last time and it fell more easily than I expected it to. It didn't even do that much damage. I expected, you know. You think of bees, they, you think of, of uh, the, the bee sting. I expected, uh, I expected the sting to be, uh, do a big pile of damage, but uh, apparently not. Oh well, anyway. Can I climb this? It's looking rather steep. Ah, frig. Ah, darn. Ah, heck. Okay. There's an idea. Okay, well... Let's circle around the sandbox and see if there's another way in, I guess. Hmm. 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 <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Thought I could land on top of the grass and have it cushion my fall, but no such luck, I guess. Hmm. Seem to have got some distance between me and the the haze uh the hazy area. Maybe I can put the helm the red ant helmet back on. That's back to the uh, the pipe. I'm just keeping an eye out, looking around on all sides. Hmm. Thought for sure the hose is going to be it. But it got too steep. Hmm. 
Hmm. What's this on the... Is the sandbox in the shape of, like, some animal or something? What is this? I'm really not sure what's in the shape of it. It's hard to tell at this angle. Let me know if you want help. Uh, it's a crab? Oh, okay. Um, I'm, I'm fine for now. I mean... I, I like I've I've just barely started looking for the solution here, so uh, I wanted I want a chance to look around before I uh, seek help. Like right now, it's still interesting to just look around and explore. So uh, like I, I don't want to I don't want to have the answers handed to me just yet. Let me just oh. be of opportunity. Gotcha. Mutation detected assassin. Something went bad. Hearing the sound of food going bad. Uh, I can ditch these then. There, extra inventory space. Suits me fine. Yeah, the bee, the, like the bee fell really easily. Like much more easily than I would have expected. Like I've been putting off trying to uh, Trying to face bees. <laughs> okay, crab, I see. His big googly eyes. It's hard to tell that those were supposed to be big googly eyes from down below. That's amazing. Yeah, I haven't figured out how to get up to the picnic bench either. <laughs> of course, I get. The I get that just thought I'd offer. Yeah, I, I appreciate that. Thanks. Hear the sound of uh, the sound of food going bad felt. Yeah. Hmm. 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 What time is it again? Fourteen twenty-two. I mean, two twenty-two p.m. Basically. Okay, well, still taking a look around. Let's let's see what's around the side here. Another juice box. These juice boxes are everywhere here. spiders. I mean, if he's by himself, I might just take him out. He's not by himself. Armed raspberry? <laughs> okay, that's kind of funny. <laughs> I don't. There are, th there are two of them. Well, I want to continue exploring, so um, can I attract the attention of one of them without getting both of them? The answer is probably not. You coming? Did you get lost?
Is that a full grown? It's a full grown orb reward, damn it. Closer. Okay, seriously? Okay, if you're gonna just, just stay put, then screw you, I'm gonna shoot you. Oh, you hit your buddy there, oops. Well, whatever, this works, I guess. Got 55 arrows. I was opening some trading cards and didn't get the card I wanted, but got the, sec the second best card in the set? Oh, okay. What, what kind of trading card? I'm curious. I mean, you know, second best doesn't sound that bad. You know, second comes right after first. <laughs> Shooting him, I guess. Magic the Gathering. Oh yeah, my uh, my brothers uh, used to be really into that. Well, my older brother. Okay, my older brother used to be into it, and my uh, younger brother. Uh, I think he's still kind of into it. Uh, so I, I've played a fair bit of uh, Magic the Gathering myself. What, I'm curious, what uh, what cards you get? Like, what does it do? I was fully prepared to go hand to hand against these guys, but if they're just going to sit back like that, then whatever, I'll just cheese them. Just shoot them from a distance. Whatever. Have it your way, I guess. Uh, another one? Okay, I'm taking the next one hand to hand. I can't be bothered cheesing him for a distance like that. Yeah, come get me. You're not gonna come get me? dangerous, but it's also a lot faster. Gotcha. What? What am I hearing? Something... There's another one? I don't see another one. Where's that coming from? I can hear it, but I don't see it. Is it like clipped through the wall or something dumb like that? A uh, new set release this weekend. Oh, cool. Four drop, four four doubles the tokens you make. Pretty cool. Hmm, that's neat. Oh. Could it be? You got this uh, conspicuous, not quite a ramp, but it goes uphill. Oh, come on. Hold on. 
if I jump up here, then I can jump up here, then jump up here. Oh, milk molar? Okay. I'll always welcome some more of those. I was just looking at this hill and going, oh, maybe this is the way up there. Maybe there's this. Really? What? What? Really? What, what, what? A new, I, new animal? Neutral, sickly, roly-poly, weakness to busting. Found mostly in the western grasslands, weakened by their surroundings, can drop tough gunk and roly-poly part on death? Huh. Weak to busting, eh? Time to whip up the hammer. It's hammer time, you might say. Not reacting to my presence. to busting but it's uh ah what the heck was that Not bad. okay this guy's apparently super tough and uh i'm not i don't think i'm prepared for this Like, I'm barely putting a dent in him, and uh, all my food went bad, so um, I'm not able to heal. Like, I'm reduced to bandage, that's all I've got left. Uh, I think I'm going to have to uh, come back to deal with that guy another time. Huh. Sickly pulley boy, yeah. Clip to the wall, yeah. That's sure what it seemed like. Okay, I'm still trying to keep an eye out for my mom always says I light up a room. Keep an eye out for opportunities to get up on top of the sandbox. Like I'm looking for uh, things I can climb on and I'm not seeing anything. Like this, this game is full of things like that. Like, like there, like, there'll be a twig which happens to go, uh, like it happens to be leaning up against it that you can climb on. I also have the uh, uh, access to zip lines now, so it could also be an option to, if I can get somewhere up higher to make a zip line that goes over top of it and then drop down into it. So I think I imagine that could be an option. Huh. The plastic fork? Ooh, oh is one who really should clean this yard up a little bit. Maybe I could get their attention. This is very conspicuous. Okay. I feel like I want to mark this. I mean, this this knife is here to act as a ramp. This game is full of stuff like that. Um, so, I'm going to place a marker next to it in case I need to find it later. What am I going to mark this with? I don't know. Have a leaf. It'll do. I marked the paper clip with the leaf thing because I was similarly in the state of like I don't know, I don't know what what to how to mark this thing. Yeah. Yeah. 
Ah, well, anyway. Let's check out this, this is a garbage pile. Supposedly there was an alternate way into the crushed Labise can? Hmm. Uh, anyway, supposedly there was, there's an alternate way in there through the garbage pile. What is this here? It's a pink slip? Oh, he was fired. This, as of the ominous? Yeah. Because, you know, that's one thing we never really established or figured out or learned. Oh, great. Time for the a little less squishy now. gas mask again. But yeah, we never we never found out. There's cloud coming off it. We never found out what, uh, like, what were the circumstances of him, like, leaving Ominent, and apparently he was fired. Let's chop up some apple bits, I guess. Is there, any, is there any good apple bits in here? Or is it all rotten? I thought maybe if there were some good apple bits in there I could... Uh, To conduct something notice for engaged in own or be played by any firm. I wonder what this says. Uh, I'm like burning. I don't want to burn through my whole torch trying to read this. Um, this is something I would it'd be better to. Check, try to check out during the day. I am curious to know what it says. What were the <clears throat> what were the terms of the the termination of his employment? My is my gas mask tricking down? Is it taking damage? I think my gas mask is taking damage in here. Which is a little alarming. Yeah, it is taking damage. Well, that's no good. Um, I, cause I don't think I have the means to repair it here. Doesn't it need, uh, doesn't it, does it need, wait, I think it needs nap fuzz, right? Oh, I, I can repair it then. Oh, well, that's no problem then. Um, 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 yeah, I just need some crude rope. Lucky thing I, uh, always keep basic supplies with me. Anyway, okay, whatever it is that's in here that's damaging, I don't know about you, I wouldn't want to drink chips. <laughs> drop of juice that I found in the middle of the garbage pile here. But anyway, uh, oh, whatever here. Oh, fired, exclamation mark. Um, 
eminent practical technologies, Dr. Wendell Tully, science... Uh, uh, scratch that. Dr. Wendell Tully, PhD. <laughs> At least they can't fire me from that. <laughs> My years of work on the spacer mattered little to eminent. The project was shut down and I was shown the door. Huh. And yet Kaminsky still works there, and he's an idiot. Hmm. I've been reduced to substitute teaching at the local school. How many times hmm. can one person be expected to explain the difference between a vector and a scalar? <laughs> if it has direction, then it's a scalar. I a mean, vector. A vector. Oh! I swear the ignorance around me is contagious. Does that normal <laughs> teacher do anything? No wonder my inventions cannot be appreciated. Our society no longer understands science. Yeah, relatable. Okay, so it was oh frig, the gas mask is still taking down. I'm 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 just I'm just sitting there letting it take damage. Ugh. Might have to come back here with a pile of nat fuzz so I can repair it at, at will. Like it's not taking damage everywhere here. There, there just looks like there, there are certain places that make it take down. And I keep seeing these wisps of like weird vapors periodically, and I'm kind of wondering. Hmm. If there's something. Yeah, so like when I step into that smoky cloud, then it, it uh, the gas mask starts taking damage. What am I hearing? Is that an ant? Hot cha chas? take on three of them before, but I'd really rather not take on more than one if I can help it. Especially since I don't have any healing sources at the moment, besides some bandages. I blocked that, I swear I did. Okay, there... Okay, let me get, get me out of here. Advisable to be taking him on in that circumstance. Yeah, whatever's in the garbage, it's different from the uh, from the the haze throughout the, the rest of this. The rest of this haze area. Like it's it's uh, it's rapidly doing damage to the uh, to the gas mask. Uh, I'm about to pass by the roly poly again. Army just passing through. Don't mind me. Like seriously, it's it's 
weak to busting, supposedly. Yeah. Maybe we should try using explosives against it. Maybe we can get some more of those brat burst thingies. Probably the best. That would be probably the best way to deal with it. Just, just, just power right on past Clippy there. He's clipping into the walls. <laughs> Maybe it's glitchy, he's glitching through the wall, something like that. Uh. New water filtration tablets needed. Anyway, look, it's probably time for me to head home. What time is it here? It's, oh, it's 2 a.m. Just a few more hours, it'll be morning again anyway. Maybe it'd be better to make my way back to the other lab entrance. Oh yeah, why don't I, uh, I carried the venom along with me specifically so I could repair the spider fang dagos. Let's, let's repair it now. Just so I don't get caught in the middle of uh, combat with it. Hmm. Yoink. this massive wall. Huh. Okay. Oh. I can actually do with some more plant fibers. I just used up some... Uh, Fibers trying to fix up the, uh, the gas mask. And I did put a roasting spit around here somewhere. Where did I put it again? Didn't I put a roasting spit here? I remember it was, I tried to put it on that rock there and it said, oh, it, oh, there you go, there it is. Ooh, I caught that one just in time. Hmm. Hmm. What time is it? Okay, we're four hours into the stream here. Uh, I should probably wrap it up soon. But, uh... to find a good stopping off point for that. It's it's like 3.30 a.m. in the in-game. Um, and uh, I'd like to... Uh, Yeah, I, I want to. I do want to be able to take some time during the actual daylight to uh, check out either that garbage pile or the sandbox or something. 
Generally, I want to look around and explore some more before I wrap up the stream. Where'd you go? Don't even need to boil it. I, I heard him, I don't see him. Oh, there he is. Maybe I can just swim through the pipe again and uh, get back to the other part of the lab where I can, so I can refill my water properly. Wait. Didn't I have another slime lantern? Is that my only slime lantern? I swear I had a second one. More of these guys? Oh well. More, lots more food. Now my inventory is all full. Okay, fine. I'll use up the last bandage then. to be carrying rotten food around with me. At least it ends. This leads to the way through. These things are still exploding up there, are they? Wait a second. Have we been to the store? Did I? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, you ca Yeah, it's mean. How dare you. Infect the ladybug. Can I get back up where there's more room to river? Thank you. What in the world is... Ah, I don't have enough 
Jesus. Okay, um, throw those away. I don't care. What is going on in here? What is all this? Why is this this door locked behind me? What the heck? What the heck in heck? That's my uh, that's my gas mask broken now, right? Oh no, I don't have the gas mask on. I feel a little less squishy now. <clears throat> Probably should have been wearing these guys while I was in there. Okay, I oh sh god damn it. I'm thinking, okay, well, at least I'm by the, the, the roses pit now, so now I can cook up all of the, uh, all the water fleas I collected, except that I can't because they're all in my body over there. It's uh, a bit of an odd design choice. They decided the... Oh, my... Okay, my shield is badly damaged. I need to, I need to go find a weevil. Oh, hello. Drawn that meat suits me fine. Uh, I was about to say, mm, I was thinking, oh, I need, I need to go find a weevil and uh, so I can fix my shield, except that. Daggerland. Where did it land? Like, yeah, I get it. It falls down when you're fighting those the infected gnats, but I don't see it now. Why is it? Why doesn't it highlight it? You know, <sighs> early in the game, it demonstrated that when you drop a weapon on the ground, it highlights it, so you can find it again. So why doesn't it highlight it now in certain... Now that's a circumstance when it would obviously make sense for me to need it to be highlighted. Like rapid, like middle... Rapidly clicking, looking for spider dagger. It's okay. It's a valuable thing that I don't want to lose. Try grass chunk. Something get blown up. Could that meat? Sure, but.
Okay, you know, if, if I if I known that there was a potential to completely lose the spider fang dagger entirely, then maybe I wouldn't have uh, been using it against the gnats. Maybe I should have just been shooting it with, with arrows from a distance. But every time he uh, it forced me to drop it, I was able to find it again. So I was like, whatever. I'll just pick it up off the ground afterward, like I've done several times before, only this time it doesn't seem to be working out for me. It was right here. This is this is where I fought him. I'm not seeing it. I mean for all I know the, the dagger might have like clipped through the floor or through the ground and it's just gone. That would be quite troubling and annoying considering that the expense that I went to in upgrading it repeatedly, like all the whetstones that I pumped into it, not to mention the, you know, spider fangs and uh, spider venom that I used to craft it, which were quite oh, Acquired from hard fought frickin' wolf spiders who are very tanky and annoying to fight. Uh, have I lost it? Is it gone for good? I don't see it anywhere. Maybe I should review the recording and uh, see if I can spot it. Like, I don't see it. This is where I was when I fought the infected gnat and he forced me to drop it. It was around here, or maybe up here, because he d he was he was hovering up here. So I thought so maybe it could be up there. Maybe that's the problem. Maybe I uh, because he was up here. Maybe maybe the when it dropped the dagger, it spawned inside this. inside this bit of the the geometry of the place <laughs> and now I'm, I'm just wasting daylight hours it's what time is it 10 33 a.m. like I'm just wasting away the daylight searching for this damn thing <sighs> okay well I don't know. I mean, I could just say screw it and get by with the bone dagger instead. At least for the time being. And then they can just switch back to the larva spike when I get back home. It seemed to be almost as good as the spider dagger anyway. Anyway, um, I have to go recover my body, and it's it's behind that door, which locked itself behind me when I went through. That should keep you safe. Safer. Am I gonna be able to get through there again? Okay, it it unlocked itself. That's just cruel. This is cruel. It's 
Should I try it again? Stack these, obviously. Stack these, obviously. You can hold everything, just stack them properly. Yeah. Wait, phase three results, what's this? Phase three results, explosive. The mutations in phase three are progressing at a rate I can't begin to quantify, and they spread to the local fauna. We just can't express the sorrow I feel for these simple creatures warped and manipulated into ravenous, horrible, exploding beings. Attempts to reverse or even slow the changes in the strange spores of the creatures that have spread to you haven't been fruitful. I'm tasking Burgle with keeping an eye on all of this and introducing security defense procedures to keep this lab safe. Catastrophic as it may be, my confidence in raw science as a catalyst for growth and change is sealed now. Granola bars. Hmm. I mean, at least I was able to get my stuff back. I mean, says I light up a room. it was kind of convenient that I managed to die in here in this hallway where, uh, <sighs> where I was at least able to. Uh, <laughs> excuse me. Uh, recover the backpack easily. Um, you know what? Maybe I'll just make a note to come back here later and um, all right I should probably get this thing ready yeah so I didn't realize there was a branching uh, path there it's just Plunks you face to face with a friggin' infected ladybug. Which would be difficult enough to deal with on its own without all the everything else. They were look I saw infected mites and infected larvae in there as well. Yeah, like maybe I should uh, bring some explosives in ah oh, frig. Explosives in there. Um I'm a little safer. Ass mask on. Yeah, let's cook these guys up. Yum. Ah, uh, well, it's daylight, so... So what am I going to do? Should I, go, should I check out the uh, sandbox again, or should I explore more of the haze area? Got a couple of Units of mite fuzz, or sorry, not mite fuzz, gnat fuzz, so I can I can repair, I can do a bit of a bit more field repair of the gas mask. Yeah, see this this the conspicuously placed twig here lets me get up on top of that rock there easily. Back up on top of the stone path. Hmm. 
seriously. I was about to try to climb back onto the, onto the porch in hopes of uh, it, would give, it would give me a better vantage point. there. Um, gaps in the boards here. I blocked that. I... Hmm. You know, I started to climb that and fell off, but now when I look, there's a sort of a secondary slope there, which I might be able to jump into that nook and climb over that way. Like, it looks like I might have been very close to uh, getting in there. So yeah, yeah. What the hey? I'll give that a whirl. Worth a try. Oh hey, darkness! Welcome, welcome to the stream. Each of you, they just realized you're streaming. Yep, so I am. <laughs> I'm uh, four and a half hours deep, and I'm probably uh, probably longer than it. Ah, uh, okay. Hmm. Well, so much for that idea. I'll make some more bandages for the heck of it. I unfortunately seem to have lost my spider fang dagger, by the way. I uh, was uh, uh, fighting an infected gnat, and it dropped, which has happened before. That seems to be what the infected gnats do. They make you drop whatever you're carrying. Uh, only I couldn't find it afterwards. It just vanished, which is weird. This, this might just be too steep. Hmm. 
Did you manage to complete any of the labs earlier in the stream? Uh, if you're referring to like the pond lab, uh, I, I think sort of, kind of. I mean, I I, I found the uh, like the, the the door in the ceiling that uh, of that chamber that I was uh, you know apparently supposed to go in all along. Um, I just heard a weevil. Where'd he go? There you go. Could do with some repair of my uh, my shield. Uh, ditch this. Got the gas mask on still, right? Yeah. So yeah, like I, I got um, like I explored that all uh, as much as I could, um, but I still found locked doors there. So I guess there's still there's still stuff to be had, still stuff to explore there. Let's need to repair this thing. Second bone, that's what I, that's what I figured. I'm stuck on things. Should I take on some more black ants? Get some more black ant parts? What's needed for the like the black ant shield and all that? Because there wasn't. Uh, oh my goodness, over here. Yeah, the black ant shield. Five black ant parts. Huh. Okay. You know what? Why don't I kill a couple more of these things? Yeah, let's let's take out uh, let's take out a couple more uh, black ants and uh, oh whoops I didn't mean to get attention to two of them. Hey hey hey! I definitely blocked that one. certainly block that one. Damaged one. Uh, I mean, they're both damaged, but which one's more damaged? Gonna be another case of another case of I brought them down to a couple of pixels and then before they kill me. <laughs> and, and I had tons of healing options, but I didn't have; they weren't ready. 
they weren't in the the quick slot. So, so much for that. Oh, don't tell me. Uh, if you open the dome, then the other doors should only require assistant manager keycard. Uh, incorrect. There was still another locked door, which uh, which didn't say required an assistant keycard, and I was nevertheless was unable to open it. I mean, you're mostly correct. Like there, there were. Uh... They're, they're like most of the doors opened, uh, aside from the, the assistant keycard requiring ones, but uh, his manager keycard. But no, there 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 were still there was still a door which didn't say assistant manager keycard, and I still was unable to open. And it led to, it, it appeared to lead to a chamber which I couldn't figure out how to get into. So that's why I expressed uncertainty about uh, if I was done with the pond lab section. How do you get so dark so quickly here? Ugh. I'm going to keep complaining about that forever. It gets too dark too quickly in this game. Sorry, what's this? Oh, hey, a locked door. Fun. Well, I'm going to mark it. Ah, except I won't mark it because I don't have the components. Because they're on my corpse over there. Uh, I can't gather the components because I need clover and there's no clover nearby. Well, where am I? Okay, so I'm just under the porch. Apparently the super chip is like very close by. This garbage pile is pretty vast, isn't it? Lots to explore there. Okay, uh, which way am I facing? Uh, west by south, west. So if I go east by northeast, I should, I should get back there again. Let me just grab my stuff. Let's get this thing out. That's the evil nose. Sorry, I just saw it. I hope all my things are still here. Okay, so face east by northeast, and I should, if I go straight ahead, I should be right there. As long as I can get over this thing. And I should find myself right next to that door I was just looking at. It's roughly, maybe. Was it next to this? Where was it? That's the exit to the haze lab, I think. Uh, who knows? Oh. What's this? It appears to be a wall, except that, oh, it's this, the inky void. I, I don't, perhaps I wasn't supposed to be here. That's a little eerie. Kind of 
sort of feel like that was supposed to be uh, supposed to be a wall there and not just a black surface. Great, the hose was visible from the door that I saw. So it can't be far from here. But when I was standing next to the door, I looked over and saw the hose. It has to be around here. This would be so much easier to find if it were daylight. But the game goes LOL, you're not going to have a reasonably uh, a reasonable amount of time in the day. We're just going to get very dark very suddenly very quickly, far too soon. And that's just the way the game is. That looks odd. You know, at the end of the last session, I was saying, I need to play something else. This is just frustrating me. And I'm feeling that again. <laughs> Maybe my next stream should be a long, dark game. What's this? What is this? Is this the the post that the uh, supports the the roof of the uh, the thing in the porch? Here's the hose leading up to the, uh, up into the sandbox again. My body was here and I made a note that it was... Like, the door, like, I don't know how relevant the location of the door is right now. I mean, it's locked anyway. But, um, I'd like to have it marked anyway. You know, so I can, like, sort of check it off the list of, uh, There it is. <sighs> okay, so it's locked. That's the other entry point there. Could this be the other the other way from that? I don't know. Um, that other branch that I found, which led to the infected ladybug and all that. Oh, let's repair up the shield. I just. It's like, oh crap, it's like very nearly broken. Uh, and this gas mask is in bad shape too. Okay, let's craft up some rope. Field repair of the gas mask. Mm. 
it's midnight. Uh, maybe I should just... Because they place twig as this. Where does this lead? An arrow here? I just want to head back, back to my home base at the moment, and uh, yeah, let's go back up on the porch one more time. Just why not? Yeah. Or not? Whatever. goes noise in here. Oops. Just run for it, just run for it. Can I circle around this way? Might be able to circle around this way. It's only 170 centimeters away, I'm getting close. Am I unable to circle in this way? Is that a wolf spider? I don't want to deal with a wolf spider right now. Hmm? Oh, it's raw science, did I miss that? Is this a wolf spider? 
pet cave? Crap. I have a sneak suspicion I don't want to be here. I thought there was an easy way out of here. I may have just doomed myself. This could be like very, very unfortunate. What's this? Okay, um, no land rights. component at a time. What do I even mark this with? Um, spider? Or is a spider, I guess. I think this is a spider cave, cave here. Um, so this is this is a bit alarming. Um, I don't seem to be able to get out of here. I don't know if I want to pick those up. If I okay. Looks like there's water down there. Oh, maybe not. No, that's no, water. Kidding me. Yeah, no kidding. an unenviable position to be in. This thing is running out. Okay, 
what's going to spoil next? Things that are about to spoil. Does this lead out? Cool. You are a jerk. You're a jerk. Stop being a jerk. You coming in here right now? Screw you. Oh, you just decided to sleep right there? I said screw you. What part of screw you do you not understand? <laughs> Can I run past him? Is that an option? Move. He's injured. Oh. He's taking damage from the haze. Like, I had no option. Um, sure, it'd be nice if we could find that. Spider Fang Dagger that it was lost right in this very spot. It just seemingly vanished. Oh well. Um, ah, jeez. Five hours into this thing. Uh, I need to wrap this up. I want to grab my corpse first. I don't want to leave this in a situation where any corpses there unrecovered. But yeah, trying to uh, back away from the wolf spider. Um, I thought I lost you. I, I um, let's just circle around this thing. Um, The fact that the wolf spider was taking damage from the haze was interesting. Um, sorry, I, I must be very tired. I'm, I'm losing the ability to focus and form meaningful sentences. Um, <laughs> but. Um, Where's my home base? Where's my home? There it is. There you go. Uh, but yeah, like the the stamina, like just from that quintuple quintuple hit that he was doing. Like, it's just the stamina hit from blocking that was brutal on its own. This, despite the fact that I have the the mutation for um, for Parry Master level three, extreme advantage when blocking attacks. I have no idea what that means. It's it's like it doesn't mean that I use less stamina. It doesn't it also doesn't seem to mean that. Um, 
Uh, I don't get knocked down when parrying. Like, who knows what it means? Anyway, I was able to get some stuff. Let's drop off the stuff. Including the, the yeah, ladybug head. Just put that in there too. Let's analyze stuff. Get some raw science. Black ant part common. Hmm. <laughs> New recipes with savored Lil Black Helm. It's <laughs> cute. And analyze Black Ant Head, which is also common. Oh, Coder, welcome. Maybe it means you attack a bit faster after blocking? Who knows? Could be. Black Worker Ant, man. Let's stuff Black Worker Ant. Yep. That's to be expected. Okay, let's, um, uh, maybe there's, I still have stuff in my inventory. I thought I'd deposit everything. Get these in here. Um, quartzite shard, can we just... Craft that up there. There we go. Cool. Um, I said I was going to wrap this up, but I'm going to just tend to. Stuff before I do that. Um, yeah, so what's this little black? Where is it? Black ant helmet. Sleek black Kabuto craft from black ant parts, right? No, the thing the thing that I just got, it had uh Like I already had the black ant helm. There, 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 it, it, there it is, Lil Black Helm, that's what I was wondering about. Black ant head and might fuzz. Give your little insect pal some samurai style. Fine gear constructed from a whole black ant head and lined with a supremely comfortable might fuzz. Extra max health? Wait, really? Huh. Yeah. Okay. Curious. Alright. Um. Uh, I was hoping to get more black ant parts. Uh, no such luck. Uh, apparently this uses bee fuzz as well. Uh, right, anyway. Getting distracted. Um, I wanted to... Trying to, grab the, trying to grab the squirrel bar so we can strike this down. Thank you. Uh, I wanted to make another... Torch Plus. Because I'm down to the last one. This is... It's, getting uncomfortably empty, um, and wanted to, oh yes, I want, definitely want to repair the bone trident, because that's uh, almost gone, and I want to cover my larva blade, where did I put it? I think I, I, think I put it in this one. There it is. Okay. All right. Um, I think that's a good stopping off point. Um, yeah. Okay. So explore the the pond lab. 
got through those lock drawers I was struggling with the uh, <laughs> the previous session, so that's good. Um, I, I just keep continuing getting blocked by more locked doors, though. Like I, I, the, I unlocked some doors in the pond lab, but there were still locked doors left there. And then I came over to check out the ha the haze lab, and there's uh, another locked door there. Other insurmountable barriers. Mm, I could figure out how to get into the sandbox. There's still other places to explore. Mm. Oh well. Um, oh, I've got four viewers at the moment still. Uh, uh, is there anyone worth rating? Who's uh, who's playing right now? Who's who's streaming right now? Yeah, I, uh, I mean, I could do what I did before and, uh, and, uh, like, uh, <sighs> look up, uh, random grounded streamers and, uh, just raid someone there, but, um, um, okay, bye for now. Okay, see you, see you, darkness. Have a good one. Um, but, uh, yeah, I, I don't know, I, 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 I sort of figure any stream that I, I raid is probably going to be people who are further into the game and uh, I, I don't I don't want to avoid spoilers so you raid Diablo Graves he's uh, he's playing Elden Ring right now uh, some I know from the from the DDLC uh, uh, community I, I, Coder have you have you played uh, I don't know if you're, if you're still there are are you, have you played um, the DDLC mod, uh, Magical, sorry, Magical Girl, sorry, no, Magical, shoot, how did, what's the title? It's a super long one. It's, it's Magical Literary Heroine Natsuki Saves the Literature Club. That's the title, that's what, uh, anyway, Diablo Graves is the, is the one who wrote that mod. <laughs> uh, it's a good mod. You should play it if you haven't yet. <laughs> um, uh, it's one of my favorites, actually. Um... <laughs> Anyway, let's give him a raid. What the hell? <laughs> Don't know uh, how much overlap there is uh, between the Grounded fandom and the Elden Ring fandom, but, you know, Diablo's cool. So, you don't think I have? Oh, okay. Well, something for you to look forward to. It's a good mod. Um, yeah, and and uh, is, is Natsuki's Nats your uh, your favorite Doki, right? So yeah, that that's that's one. You, yeah, you definitely put that on your your to do list. Uh, I think you'd really like it. I mean, I mean I'm not even terribly fond of Natsuki, but. Uh, but uh, it's it's a it's a good mod. It's um. It's it's a save the Doki's mod done right, <laughs> uh, I guess I could say. Anyway, um. Yeah, we'll add it to the list. Cool. Um. Yeah. So. <sighs> obviously, I'm very tired right now, <laughs> and. Um, uh, I, I, I think my next stream is going to be something different. I think it has to be. Uh, his grounded is just wearing me down into the ground, you could say. Um, I'm thinking I might pick up Long Dark again, or maybe I'll play something different. I don't know. I'll see how I feel, I guess. But uh, that's it for now. Until next time. <laughs>